my hello everybody again. How are <laughs> how are we? Uh Colby, hey girl. Oh my gosh, Texas, hello, you made it. How are you? Hope that you're doing pretty well. Or well, I don't know why I said pretty, but like you know what I mean. <laughs> how are we doing? I wasn't expecting her to go live, but then again, unfortunately, I was. So Zen, hey guys, how are we doing? Hope we're all doing well and um, I'm probably not going to be here a whole lot, especially with this live stream, just especially today. Just, I got better. Th well, no, I, I have video games to play that I'm really getting into. And of course, I see the notification like, gosh, dang it. How oh, dare. Really getting into it too. It's getting good. <laughs> Hello, guys. How are we? And Maggie, you did. Hello. How are we? I hope that's, I will, I hope everything's well um, down south. <laughs> Oh, Rebecca, hey, girl. Um, She is celebrating getting um verified, which uh, you can only do if you hit 1,000 subscribers, even though, you know, you can... Or even though she pretty much begged and pleaded people to get to 100K. So great job, Chantal. Wonderful job. <laughs> ah, never a dull moment here. Never a dull moment. Hey, girls, how are we? Zen, exactly. And on top of that, um, <laughs> I saw on Twitter that, uh, you know, 100,000 people are, you know, are subscribed. 200, like 50 to be generous in chat. So not exactly how, you know, I'm not exactly sure how that works. Like 100,000, 200 people. Like math is not mathing, even though I'm not super great with math. Um, I think that's a pretty small percentage. <laughs> even people from the Western world, it's just like uh, it's still pretty decent time here. It's only, I mean, right here on the East Coast, it's only seven thirty, and you only get like, well, I mean, maybe eh, maybe six thirty around um, whenever she started streaming, and like really, Ugh. yeah, mm hmm. So let me get Chantal on screen because I could be hard, I could be here all day talking. <laughs> and let's see. Oh, did I, did I speed her up? I don't. I did not speed her up. I'm so sorry. I almost got everything set up. Let's see what Chantal has to say today, shall we? And if I skip around more than usual, sorry, but like it's you know it's Chantal, so not really sorry. <laughs> um, thank you, Lisa. I cannot wait to see your black nut on your teeth. <laughs> Sati. <laughs> so if you change your username, you lose the verification, but you, all you have to do is just reapply for it again. That's all. Which she's okay. Well, just based on that, she more than likely probably, even though if, even though if she was reading a chat, she probably kind of regrets, you know, changing her branding and someone else took her old YouTube username. Like people have done time and time again. Why she hasn't learned her lesson the first time could not tell you. I'll text this. Thank you so much for gifting five memberships. I appreciate it. I'm not sure if StreamYards tells me who did. I don't think it does, unfortunately. But thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, Nosferatu. And girl, I, I will. Don't you yeah, worry. So, um, <laughs> wait, I got to do something. I, uh, yeah, I've just been like, oh my gosh, trying to cope with many different things and getting ready for Ramadan and uh, whoops, whoops. Hold on. I'm just trying something here. Um, yeah. So I was just, uh, let's celebrate. I made a thumbnail for that. Um, yeah. Okay. There we go. Live chat replay wasn't on. So I wanted to make sure it was. So anybody missing this can watch it after. Derek. Hello. Thank you. Desert Rose. Miss Foodie. How are you? I'm great. How are you? YouTube lover, halal pickle party. <laughs> mm, pickles. Hey, Angel of Mercy. Ramadan menu. I'm, I'm testing, I've been testing out things. And what I discovered is, you know how I had a whole lot of like cleaning out of my kitchen and reorganizing it? I had to do. I'm just going to have one chip. Okay, yeah. One turns into two, two, two turns into five, five turns into ten, and the cycle continues. Why she will never see that, I don't understand. And that's also coming from me that also does the same thing. I'll just have one. I have to have another one. It's fine. 
yeah, a few more. It's not gonna, and, and then it just snowballs from there. <laughs> Good Women's Day today. Hi, Sue Ann. Welcome, Salam. Kiki, thank you. Hi, Straight Piff. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna skip forward just a little bit more because she's still saying hi to people. I'm a mess. So I've just been like cooking and cleaning and cleaning and cleaning. And um, oh my gosh. So and, and for someone help. that's home 24 7 and has quite literally nothing better to do, she is, she does claim claim big quotation marks there to just be cleaning all day like I, how how well are you cleaning to begin with if you have to keep cleaning that much i have a lot of questions i will never get any of the answers to them the way it is it's, it's hard you know so hey like, guys i need i need a, a six-pack journey <laughs> thanks moonflower i'm in a pretty good mood hi colleen what's up <laughs> hi anastasia tracy hello tracy and Okay, so a good like quarter or one tenth of this live stream is just saying hi to people, which you know she's allowed to do, but just girl, come on. <laughs> he does help me, but the kitchen is kind of my thing, you know. What kind of chips did you have, Katrina? Thank you, Lynn. You're so sweet. Yeah, and we do brush her. She has her brushy brush and her comey comb time, but it's just brushy. never brushy brush and her comey comb time. Um. How about you get her neuter wootered? And how about that? Is that on the table anytime soon? <laughs> the fact that I just said that could help me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shush. Thank you so much for coming in. I appreciate it. And girl, good luck. And also, I agree, like medical stuff. Or I'm not, why did I say medical? Just like, I mean, my medical stuff is important, but like school stuff is more important. I don't know. Why did my brain automatically? Well, probably because watching Chantel, but thank you so much for stopping in. Ever ceases to uh, go down. It's crazy. And some cats just don't really shed that much. No way, CM. Hi, Lizette. <laughs> <clears throat> So the chips we have here, I'm eating local chips. Local they, chips. Oh, come? while you're being on YouTube, of course. And also, what brand? Probably couldn't tell you, but while being on YouTube. So a great job boycotting. A plus. You can go for, oh, not tonight. Yeah. It's like, what, two in the morning? All the gins are out at two in the morning. I should go down. Down to the beach at sun, yeah, sunrise or what sunset? No, I don't know if they have funyuns here. I've never seen them. Yeah, I know striper change is so easy. This is a small bag. Okay. Oh, thank God, your diabetes is probably saying, "Oh my God, <gasps> thank." I was really afraid that that was going to be the big bag, but since it's the it's the small bag, it's fine. Like, don't worry about it, girl, girly pop. You're good. I'm so happy that you chose the smaller bag, which, I mean, could be worse, but, like, at the same time with Chantal's medical issues, I mean, probably not the best to begin with. Hope that you're keeping that in check, girly. That's why we just buy the small small bags now. But... And on top of that, that's half of her personality. Well, the majority of her YouTube personality, at least, probably the same in real life. Can't confirm or deny, but... um. It's Chantal's pretty much her only pastime and her only passion, and yet she's still so bad at it. Cannot tell you. Okay, I'm done. You can easily, they only have like a few, they're very small bags, but you can easily eat more if you're not careful. And girl, you quit trying to like justify it. Like it's, well, it's, you know, only small bags. Your diabetes is probably like, oh my God, thank you so much. It's the small bags. Just thank, girl. Shh. Hot fries, yeah. Do I like hot Cheetos? Not really. I like normal Cheetos. I do have Instagram, Chantal YouTube. Now we have like, um, in Canada, we have a cheesies. They're called Hawkins cheesies. And they're like only in Canada. Okay. Oh my God. Well, like, why don't you go back there and show us? That'd be great. This is why I waited until I went live. Because that way we can do that and not have to listen to it. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, computer. Oh, or, okay, I'm assuming that she went AFK. So, there. The grossest food ever had in my life is probably blood pudding. There we go. And never tried it. Cannot cannot confirm or deny. Why is Kleenex banned in Canada? Oh yeah, let's try for change in Nikotado. 
pig farms feed their pigs potato chips to fatten them up. Aw. Yeah, baby, pigs are cute. What? Oh, good kitty. What did you have? I've, n I've been to Dubai Airport, but never to Dubai. Last time I went to Canada, I took, I think, was it last time I went to Canada, I took Emirates <clears throat> on the way there. And, uh. Oh, Chantal, what was that about quit, like quitting smoking? I'm pretty sure that was a vape puff. So, you lied then. <laughs> Either that or she just started back up. I thought you that you quit smoking, guys. Like, don't worry about it. Like, whatever happened to that? Oh, and Gamer, she is currently eating chips. But, like, do not worry. Do not worry. Like, stay in your seats. I know that you're you're probably really worried. But, like, don't worry about it. It's the small bags. So, like, it's fine. <laughs> we have to go to the Dubai airport, which... In all honesty, I prefer the Doha. Oh, and I did not see that about um, Blood Pudding on Twitter, but not surprising. You know, even though she's, not, she's totally not on Twitter, guys, right? <laughs> Turkey, Dubai, Kuwait. Must have gone a double date with you guys. <laughs> Blue pot. I got verified. That's why. 101K. Oh, shoot. Even though you had to beg and plead people and go to a sub for sub thing to try to... <laughs> <laughs> to try to get to they're trying to get to 100k Chantel you you honestly out of all the things I feel like that's pretty pretty big up there about the things that you'll be laughed at you had to beg people to sub to your account to get to 100k congratulations well done <laughs> and that allegedly I would not be surprised too very odd. Very odd. Hold on. I'm not on live chat. Sorry, guys. Maybe I'm missing your comments, but I don't think so. Anyway. Should come visit Texas. <gasps> Barbecue! Is it halal? <laughs> Celebrating chips, but making it to okay. Orange is the worst flavor color. It's the worst for health, isn't it? She should chips and soda is not the way to six-pack. I know, Brenda. I need willpower. <laughs> Um, if you're verified, it just means you have that little check mark beside your name. But I guess on mobile, it doesn't show up for some people. I don't know if that's that's just for iPhone because for me, it shows up on my phone, you know. But yeah, I can also request a plaque. I was like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm still scared. no because if if you if you I think well number one she's not like eligible. I'm gonna be like multitasking here. Just give me one second. I wanted to see if I see her. I have a Android um, S24 Ultra. Um, for context but um what was i saying oh yeah she's not she's not um eligible for the plaque because her channel got um yeeted before so that i'm having a hard time believing i could be wrong about that but i'm pretty sure she's not eligible for a plaque because her channel got terminated during the whole omegle thing so mm -hmm, sure you were able or you were eligible mm -hmm, sure mm -hmm, we believe you but I'm like, yes, my, my subs are, you know, kind of remaining the same and growing a bit. So I just want to thank you guys, you know, for my channel growing. Oh, I wonder why begging people and having to go to a chat for, I'm sorry, sub for sub, um, having to go to a, sp a specific channel to try to get. Yeah, I, I wonder why you're gaining subs all of a sudden. Wow, it's magical. 1K or 800 overnight. It's magic. I know. Wow. Complete mystery as to why that's happening. <laughs> Um, I don't know, like, you know, sometimes I see people say, Hey, I'm new here, but think about it. Whenever you subscribe to a channel, you don't always comment or, you know, I never, when I subscribe to a channel, I hardly ever comment like sometimes true, but like at the same time, girl, 100,000 people and 200 are watching 250 to be generous at the time that she was live 200, not 2000, not 20,000 people. No, no, no. 200 out of a hundred thousand people. So, mm hmm. And hey, girlies, how are we? Hope that we're doing good. And exactly. <laughs> but <clears throat> thank you, Kitty. Hello, barbecue. Why don't you show your face anymore? No, that's okay. My leg is sore, Siam. That's why I'm, like, sometimes it's just late and I don't feel like... Okay, wait. So it's late, but now, hold on. Now she mentioned her leg again? Hold on. I'm spot. <clears throat> Thank you, Kitty. Hello, barbecue. 
why don't you show your face anymore? No, that's okay. My leg is sore, Sian. That's why I'm like sometimes. It's oh, mentions the leg, but then completely the second that she realizes, like, oh, I already said that my that my leg was better. Complete conversation change. Oh, it's late. Um, what about the leg? You just mentioned the leg, and then completely did a misdirect with the leg. Mm -hmm. Interesting. It's just late. And on top of that, like her leg is allegedly better, or you know, better than what it was. And like, why is she doing this kind of live then? Mm hmm. And I don't feel like getting dressed up, and you know. Like oh, in Aries, she was. Um, I think it was like early to mid 2022. She was doing like an Omegle stream, and um, somebody whipped out, or a male whipped out his um. I think you can fill in the blanks there. And then she got terminated because in words, and then she got terminated because um, people reported her and then she lost her channel. But then right a few days before Cuba, I'm not sure if you ever remember the Cuba thing, but she got her channel back. Putting hijab on and I just want to be comfortable and just chill with you guys. Like it's more comfortable for me, but uh, I'm definitely going to show my face again. Maybe like tomorrow. Don't stop believing. Hold on to that feet. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Jethro. Isn't Jethro a band name or something? You see it too, Stride for Change? Do you guys see the tick beside my name? Oh, She's and I do see it on the um my phone. I think seal time in bed. <laughs> I saw so my wardrobe blue pot is huge. It's like the size of our whole wall. And it's a mirror. Like it's a whole mirror, okay? When you close the doors. And I just like looked over the other day. Well, I do this quite often now, but and I just happened to see myself sealing out. And I'm like, I actually literally look like a seal because of the way my body's shaped. And then right at the bottom, I have two little feet that look like little flippers. <laughs> and then Julia, she sits like a seal right beside me. It's the best feeling, I gotta say. I could live like this forever, but I know it won't make me healthier. <laughs> How many countries have you visited? Moonflower, um, the US, Cuba. Qatar and Kuwait. So like four. Am I forgetting anything? Oh, in Thailand, five. How can I forget Thailand? I, I, girl, I don't I don't even know how you forgot Thailand. You were miserable there. <laughs> and I'm um, also, Bessie, that is such a rude comment towards wal walruses. How dare you? They are so cute. <laughs> oh, y'all. Yeah, kitty. Um, yeah, for sure. Uh, Lizette, no, not at all. Like, my hair's thin, but it's, like, better than it was, for sure. Um, I've been using treatments and things. But when I first met him, I would wear, like, a cap because my hair was, like, short, short, like, small. And he, like, took it off, and he's like, you know, you don't have to be shy around me. Like, we're, you know, we're married, and so. And also, yeah. on top of that, um, he saw everything. She still had, like, videos and live streams up whenever she had her bald head. So, like, I don't know exactly why. And... There's a lot of questions I will never get any of the answers to. Oh, like, thank you so much for becoming a member. I appreciate it. You make me feel good. Maybe you can use an AI avatar when you don't feel like coming on. Yeah, that's what this is here, the beezing hour. Someone made it for me. <laughs> you don't see the check mark, but it is white and not blue. Ah. Okay, yeah, some people might see it, some people might not. Yeah, see, and we don't deal with time change. The Navy Abaya seal cosplay. <laughs> Some soda, root beer, and pizza. I know. I want pizza. Congratulations. You have worked hard to get there. Get here. Oh, yeah. We're working real hard making people this up. That's never not going to be funny to me. Every single time that she mentions, like, I work so hard to get here. Yeah, you work real hard to beg people to come to your channel. <laughs> Great job. Working so hard. Uh, oh, gamer fan, what kind of pizza? That's the most important question. That sounds really good right now, actually. <laughs> the check is white, but I see it. Oh, okay. Thank you, Jamie Duncan. That's nice. I mean, like I said, I've been on YouTube for what? How many years has it been? Let me just see. I need my calculator for it to be. Well, I mean, then on top of that, um, you could probably do that on both of your hands. Right, then it hasn't been more than ten, and then on top of that, you privated slash deleted pretty much the majority of your videos beforehand. So it's going to be kind of hard to get an actual estimate without you either if they're privated going back into your YouTube Studio and looking back at your first upload, or you know if they're deleted, then it's kind of going to be impossible. 
to uh, unless if she uploaded the year that she um made her channel it's gonna be kind of hard oh hello thank you so much for the super chat i appreciate it and oh girl of course i'm gonna be forever laughing at the fact that she had to, <laughs> she had to beg people because <laughs> it's never not going to be funny it's always going to be like no matter what the context is it's going to be hilarious that she got um <laughs> she got cut doing a sub for sub thing uh, never a dull moment around here, I will say. Perfectly accurate. I don't trust my math, even simple math. Okay, so let's say I started in, um, it's 2024 minus 2017. Seven years! Oh, I want, geez, you know what, I was gonna say I want a million at that point, but no, I'm happy. This is like, my like, I'm happy with ever having 100k. I don't care about, like, I will never care about number of subscribers after this, but if they keep going up, then hey, it's nice. Well, oh, I mean, you never cared about them allegedly beforehand, and you never cared about reaching 100k beforehand, but, not, you know, you really do seem now to really care about it. Interesting. <laughs> you don't get, you also don't get paid for subscribers, but so what, you have a following, and, you know, I don't know. You see the yeah. chart dream? The, yeah, which the majority of them either don't watch you or dislike you so much. So I guess it was it really worth it at the end of the day? Was it really worth all of that trouble and heartache just to get a virtual number to go up? Was it really, really, really worth it? I hope it was. Thanks. Makes sense to me. You don't think about shaving your head again. No. Well, sometimes I get tired. Yeah. I hate watching this avatar. Not you. <laughs> I know, Tracy. Sorry, guys. I don't use hair fibers, no. Salah hates them, so he prefers my natural look. The new theater mode on YouTube is great. Oh, you know, the natural look. The woman that literally threw on a hijab, like, the the same exact week that um, he, um, or she met him through Tinder. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sure. Mode? Chicken Alfredo pizza? I crave sometimes chicken barbecue pizza, but other than that, I hate chicken on pizza. I don't know why. It has to be, like, cold cuts, you know? You'll never get your health under control unless you stop giving into your cravings. I know. Yeah, I know. I'm fully aware. <clears throat> yes, Katrina. Ken, oh, it's congrats, Beezer. Thank you. Fufu Edgar. No, 2017. Right? Oh, Blue, so thank you for the super chat. And yep, we're back. I was I was kind of wondering if she was going to go live, but here we are. But I'm just going to skip for just a little bit. We're talking about pizza, which I love pizza. Don't get me wrong, but just we, we have enough food talk on this channel enough. We're good. In an elementary school, and my, my the male teacher even cringed, and he's had to pull me aside and was like, "You could never, you could never." He literally said, "He's like, you can never do that. You can really cause." Oh, like hold on, let me go back and see what this, this alleged teacher did. Hold on, again, twenty five, thirty year old stories that we're still reminiscing about Canada. Nice. I mean, like I said, I've been on YouTube for what? How many years has it been? Let me just see. I need my calculator. Well, sometimes I get tired. Yeah, I hate watching this avatar. Not you. <laughs> I know Tracy. Sorry, guys. I don't use hair fibers, no. Salah hates them, so he prefers my natural look. The new theater mode on YouTube is great. There's a new theater mode? Chicken Alfredo pizza? I crave sometimes chicken barbecue pizza, but other than that, I hate chicken on pizza. I don't know why. I went back just a little bit to too far, like, sorry. Pizza, right? <laughs> You'll never get your health under control unless you stop giving into your cravings. I know. Yeah, I know. I'm fully aware. <clears throat> yes, Katrina. Ted, oh, it's congrats, Beezer. Thank you. Fufu Edgar, no, 2017, right? 2014 is like I had this I had a YouTube channel but I would just use it to watch you know box Cheetos hot mac and cheese I will never try that yeah it's actually not that good the best box mac and cheese ever is a good old craft dinner <laughs> if I had a million dollars don't forget to factor in your employee subs reaction channels you're basically <laughs> yeah right 100k is bigger than most small towns that's true moonflower oh yeah Brenda China like a yeah the, the wrestler chick because I used to have nice hair back then, grade eight, obviously. And uh, I used to have bangs straight across and long black hair. So they called me China. Oh, the Jelly Bean, thank you so much. For, oops, that's the wrong one. Thank you so much for gifting uh, five memberships. I appreciate it. Uh, like they thought it was, especially this one guy. Ugh. He, he was so annoying. He was the biggest bully always. Anyway, well, he's the again, one. Again, talking about stuff that happened 25, 30 years ago, girly. He would bully me, bully me year after year. And then one day we were playing baseball, soccer, baseball, or baseball. And he, um, he had, he touched me inappropriately. Oh, okay. Uh, what? Not exactly sure if the story is true. If it is gross, but we've, I've never heard about the story before. Jesus. So when he was running to second base, this is the guy, the, the story where I kicked him really hard in the junk. 
and it really hurt him. Like he was on the ground crying and screaming. And it was just like an instinct because like everything had been bottling up inside of me. I, and I was surprised at my strength and how much, how hard I kicked him. I didn't like, I like blacked out, you know, this happened in elementary school. And my, my, the male teacher even cringed and he's had to pull me aside and was like, you could never, you could never, he literally said to me, he's like, you can never do that. You can really cause like infertility. You can cause so many problems if you do that to a man. And, um, you know, I was like, well, he, he, you know, he did this to me and he, I don't know what happened. Like I just kind of, uh, raged out, you know? So yeah, but he would always call me China, China or Ricky. Hey, Ricky, go Ricky. You know, like that kind of thing. And I'm like, why is that an insult? Ricky Lake is a beautiful woman. So she's overweight, whatever. Now looking back at it, it's so stupid, you know? <clears throat> anyway, I hope he's okay. I didn't mean to hurt him that bad. I think he has kids. The last late, latest update I heard from people, like when I get updates of like, you know. Oh, Blues, thank you so much for the super chat. And like, if this story is true, I mean, mm -hmm. not going to say that I disagree with Chantal's move there. This was years ago I got an update, but I think he has kids, so we're good. <laughs> Best box is Kraft, thick and creamy. Velveeta cheese. I find Velveeta cheese. Thank you, Katrina. I love you guys. Um, and by the way, when I say I love you guys, you say wanna come on. <laughs> that means you too. Right, babe? Uh, I'm sorry. I, I, uh, at least we, whenever she's on camera, you can actually pause it before. Girl, mute your mic. Jesus Christ. Ugh. <laughs> Desert Rose. Yeah, I kind of agree, but I craft dinner was made with butter and no milk, maybe a little bit of cream. Oops, my finger slipped a bunch. I'm not, I'm not going back. <laughs> what are you talking about? No abuse. I hated PE back in the day. Yeah, me too. I always hated it. That's where I got my lowest marks, of course, because you had to like they always wanted us to play the stupid um, trampoline or like parachutes or sometimes duck duck goose, and I could never catch the person. <laughs> Girl, like. If, if we're talking about like PE in like elementary school, like elementary school PE was great. You got you got to play with like the parachute thing and like the city scooter things that like nobody really knew how, like what their use was or how to play with them and like tetherball. That was the thing at my elementary school. I'm not exactly sure if that was the thing where you guys grew up, but like honestly, like that was like my fa one of my favorite sports. <laughs> of course, when you get older, it's not super fun, but like especially in those early days, that's wonderful oh i miss those days <laughs> like i hated pe i was not you know not physically um that wasn't my forte basically you know i always picked last or if we played murder ball i was always the first one out I, i've never i'm assuming she means dodgeball but i've never heard it be called murder ball before i mean i can kind of see why because it only takes one uh really good hit to the <laughs> to the face with a with the dodgeball to, to get where that meaning comes from i, I it, it was an accident to be fair but it happened to me once and who lordy it was not fun not the hall card yes <laughs> oh you wouldn't stop singing who's that <laughs> Who's that wonderful girl? I will not. I will not let her um, defile Nana Land like that. Mona is is precious. Don't ruin it for me. Love your cat. Congratulations, Mary. I'm ready. Set these. Ready. Set. Ready. Oh, What's wrong? It's so. They're so cute. I love it. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe nothing exciting. I just worked a lot and partied and hate dodgeball too. I know, right, Lynn? Uh. Oh wait. So is murder ball and dodgeball not the same thing? Huh, I'm. I'm. Does anybody know what what murder ball is? If it's different than dodgeball, because I honestly thought dodgeball and murder ball was the same thing. Because again, it only takes one <laughs> one ball to the face, and not the fun guy either. I was on all the drugs in my yeah, exactly. <laughs> I was picked last in sports too, so I pretended to be sick or injured. But yeah, I know it's not nice, you know. Why do they make us pick teams? So stupid. I don't know. It gives people a complex a little bit. I still remember that. Any well, girl, if it's still bugging you like 30, 40, uh, well, 25, 30, 35 years later, go see someone about it. That's the only thing I really got to say about it because, ugh, Lord. This is what I did today. I did talk about that at the beginning. Just domestic stuff. Cooking and cleaning and cooking and cleaning and cooking and cleaning and cleaning and cooking. I, I, my, I, this thing finger keeps slipping and I just, it, I feel like it would be a lot of work to try to go back, so I'm just going to press play. <laughs> collection of red flags <laughs> yeah like those it was always like the big guy in class too they would let him just whip the ball at people <laughs> like it would sting those stupid balls you know i've met every toxic abuser i've ever known in my 20s uh i see yeah i've met a few of those 
Good thing you're with someone else now, right? I mean, wasn't the only man that she was ever really seeing in her 20s allegedly was like Pete's and BB, right? Like, like, who else are we missing? Because we would have heard all about this boyfriend and everything that they've ever done and talked about, like, everything that they went through, this and that and the other. I don't know anybody else besides Pete's and BB that she knew in her earlier years, so. Hmm. Oh, maybe that's who she's talking about, which, ugh, but I, I don't, well, she also said like in her 20s or that comment mentioned her 20s. So I don't know. Interesting. No, Richard, he doesn't, he doesn't, uh, you know, anything in my past is irrelevant to him now. So which it should be, you know? Hi, Giggle Spit. And the only person that keeps bringing him up in live streams is you. I mean, you can just ignore those messages. No one says that you have to comment on every single comment that comes in your live chat. But yeah, Chantal really just makes the point to make sure to comment on all the stabby comments. Girl, just let, just let his channel go. Just let, like, let it be. Let everyone forget about him. Even though you're the one that brought him on this platform to begin with. Just let him go. Let him go. I had my kids in 20 that wanted the kid part. I hate cat. Yeah, that's no problem with that. I mean, it's probably better, you know, to do it early. It takes years and years of partying to make it out. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jamie. Yes, I do take good care. I'm switching careers. I'm trying to be a pilot now. Oh, wow. That sounds like a hard job. I hope you, you uh, are successful. I can't play music. Uh, makes sense to me on YouTube. I don't know about Twitch, though. I'm not sure. Yeah, they let classmates throw dark balls at you and then wonder why your generation ended up with anxiety. <laughs> yeah, seriously. What do you... Uh, yeah, Nosferatu. Well, there's good ones out there, too. That was hope. Blue pot. What do I order for dinner? What are you hungry for? And it's going to do that. Uh... Uh, Rose, I don't know. I think I saw your comment. I didn't approve it. I have no idea. I've seen it on the news. I feel bad because a lot of people. Well, yeah, that's weird. I don't know. It sounds like paranoia. They should. I don't think they should ban it. But I don't think that TikTok spies on anyone. Just like, you know, probably other like Apple. So many other apps do that. <laughs> so like, oh, I've never oh, tried girl, that. everything is listening at all times. If you talk about, I don't know, like umbrellas. I really want an umbrella. I just, I need an umbrella right now. Wow, it looks really rainy out there. I really want an umbrella. I'm, I'm promising you, whenever I open my phone or my computer, um, I'm going to be getting, I'm going to be getting nothing but uh, umbrella ads every single time. Never fails. Some are they good? Oh, Bolin, thank you so much for coming in. And girl, I don't blame you. I'm I'm jumping around. <laughs> I don't blame you at all. Have a great night. No, I swear. I think I did. Go back and check. I don't know why that wouldn't be approved, honestly. Because you have a point. Like, I guess I just don't think about it because, like, you know, with the advertising, the cameo thing with, like, because, like, most of my, I would say over 95% of my audience are from the U.S. Or, like, 90% are from the U.S. Then there's, like, like eight percent or something from Canada. <clears throat> I have very little viewership, like uh, you know, like <laughs> from other regions. Like there's some from Australia, UK, Germany, stuff like that. But there's a few. There's some in Kuwait, but it's mostly you know U.S. I wonder what my analytics are. I've never checked. I I know that I know that there is a thing for that. I actually I'm gonna go look. No one move or move. I I can't tell. I well I can't see you. So move or don't move. <laughs> and I don't have, probably have that many um, Muslim viewers. So I was trying to appeal to like my larger audience. Can help me, um, you know. And then, like, I looked it up, and I'm like, uh, it says that we can wish, you know, like Christ, like our fellow Christians, their holidays. But then some people think that it's like, you know, you shouldn't be helping them celebrate. I don't know. <clears throat> so that's why I did that. The replies get held for review too, Rose, and I just forget to like sift through them. <laughs> so that's what happens. <laughs> that's why. But yeah, I do keep keep it like kind of tight on the comments because I don't want like a negative environment you know 
Oh, okay. I have an official. Oops, I'm clicking on the wrong thing. Uh, okay, so my audience, I can only speak for myself here. This is what's on my analytics. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I need to go to the side here for a bit. United States, 62 percent. I was actually expecting more, to be honest. Uh, the UK, eight point five. Canada is eight point two. Australia is three point eight. Germany, two point four. Oh. Uh, uh, well, hello, Germany. I did not know anybody watched me from Germany. <laughs> Netherlands is 0 0.9. Sweden is 0 0.8. France <laughs> is 0 0.6. Ireland is 0 0.6. New Zealand is 0 0.5. South Africa is 0 0.5. Poland, Australia, Finland, Romania. Wow, guys. Let me go mexico belgium I, I skipped a few uh brazil yeah wow it's a lot of people uh oh oh wait hold on uh and there's a lot of zero point ones okay i just wanted to check <laughs> you're welcome <laughs> a lot of canadians don't see your channel i don't know pink season it's so weird yeah i'm staying in kuwait specs you're doing right no worries thanks Ryan. she's almost a 40 year old woman she can do what she wants Hi, Blondie. Yeah, I stopped smoking shisha, but I'm still vaping here and there. Obviously, I'm having trouble uh, picking that habit rolls, obviously. So you're not quitting smoking. <laughs> yeah, I quit smoking, but, like, she's obviously still vaping, so you're not quitting smoking. You quit You quit shishaing, which I guess it's better, but, like, at the same I feel like the damage is kind of already done, girl. 100, 100 cigarettes an hour or something? I forgot that. Is it 100 or 200? But, you know, that's it's a, it's quite a bit for whatever it is per hour. If you hear me vaping, you know. <laughs> well, you just reaction saying you know, go to food banks. It's so ridiculous. Um, no, we don't. I don't even know if there are food banks here. I, I have no. I don't think. I'm not sure, but I know there's charities. But no, we don't go to food banks. And even if we did, I don't see what the uh, issue is. You know, people. I mean, if people have to use them, but we don't. You know, mashallah, we don't have to. But no, it's sometimes. Well, Texas, don't forget about the Coca Cola, but like not the Coca Cola. Wink, wink, wink. Uh, that was also a thing that she did. Uh, there's a lot. And yet, for some reason, she will never wake up. I swear. She, it's just like life is just handing her every opportunity. Like the worst thing that she has is like she's fatigued and that she has, a, you know, diabetes. And I, I feel like the most minimum side effects that anyone can go through. And yet she is just like, oh, well, I don't care. I'm going to have a small bag of chips. It's fine. Oh, like life is handing you so many opportunities right now to try to get your life on track, and yet you're just laughing at them while you just like let them like fly away in the wind <laughs> every single time. It's like certain grocery stores have really good sales. That's all it is. How would it be bad to be kind to someone and wish them a good holiday of theirs? Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it is. Zero nicotine vapes. No, I didn't even know those existed. Yeah, exactly, Rose. <laughs> Hello, Nuto Squishy. I don't see what the big issue is with a lot of things. There isn't. There's just not really much to react to anymore. That's why people are desperate and reaching for things that don't matter. Okay, well, girl, if you're not going to be telling us the truth, we have every single right, no matter how stupid it is, um, to speculate. You you don't get to dictate people like that. Not at all. Nope. Oh, sorry. You might not like it, but, you know, if you actually gave your audience something to watch, maybe people would, you know, quit talking about other stuff. But, you know, she won't get that. She never will. She never has. <laughs> Like content that's actually worthwhile and you know people might like. Nah, just make super low budget stuff. Um, not put any sort of effort into it, and um, wonder why everyone's talking about it. Yeah, I wonder why. Wow, it's not like you could have tried, but oh, and Jamie, yep, I, we did. <laughs> Which honestly, I probably, I, I definitely do um, eat like a twelve inch. So like, I can't comment on it too much, but yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> no rose i don't actually though lie a lot i don't okay so she's so, so she pretty much just admitted that she lies well i don't lie a lot that really says something about you girl if you have to specify that you don't lie a lot then what what does that say about her then jeez oh, so keep print clicking what do i lie about oh Have you tried but what what did I lie about? Um, wondering where your brand new subs came from. That's that's a new one. Like, well, I I contacted YouTube to see if you know if people bought subs. Yeah, girly, why were you contacting YouTube preemptively? 
you know that you were going to get caught. Like, I don't know where these subs are coming from, guys. It's so weird. Sub for sub. <laughs> Congratulations. That's one thing. And many of other things that I could get into, but I really don't feel like it. That's just one thing. Zero nicotine vapes. Okay, here yes. I already replied to that. But just the fact that you're awesome. Address it. Thank you, Silvio. <laughs> There's fridges in the streets of Kuwait. No way. I didn't know that Nosferatu, really? Where you can put your leftover food for people to take. Ah, oh, get out of here. Did you know that, babe? I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's a religion supposed to be a super tolerant, respectful of others. Yeah, it is. You know, it really is. I ordered a chicken finger platter. This place has the best honey mustard. Honey mustard. Oh, actually, if it's good honey mustard, yeah. <laughs> there's yeah. no shame in food bags. I'm also a, um, I'm a ranch person on everything, every single thing. N no, I really don't care what it is. I will put ranch on it. <laughs> Apparently, they're now analyzing the labels on the carrots, and it matches the food bank. What? There's no... First of all, there's no label on the carrots. And the vegetables come from um, an online grocery store, not from a food bank at all. I can actually... The next time the sale is on, I can actually screenshot the vegetables to show you if you like. That's from a grocery store. <laughs> like, it's so stupid. Promise me I'll stop reacting to reactions of reactions. I don't even... I don't do that anymore, Blue Pot. Hi, Georgia girl! I, you don't do that anymore. Well, word. It's, you, you don't do that anymore up until you either you need more views. It's the end of the month. Uh, you're just mad in general, I and mean, probably just redirecting your anger. Yeah, you don't do that anymore. For now, <laughs> I've been live for 52 minutes. Oh, gal, Charlotte, I got pissed off and changed my name, and someone took it after 15 years. Ah, you mean the handle? That sucks. Somebody took Foodie B. I don't care. I, I only like. Foodie Beauty, the handle's been gone for a long time. So Foodie B... The, well, the Foodie Beauty, there's a person that also goes by Foodie Beauty, which is actually, I'm pretty sure, could be wrong about this, a, like, a cook channel. Like, I'm pretty sure it's a lady. I mean, I can go check real quick. Um, but, yeah, that channel was gone because you didn't, whenever the new tag system came out, she didn't go... Um, she did not go grab her tag, and so the other person got it first. So, Foodie yeah. yeah, it's a it's a lady that has 1.21k. She does cooking videos, I believe. Yeah, cooking. Well, a few cooking videos. I'm not exactly sure what this channel is, to be fair. It's a bunch of pictures and products. I don't know. But anyways, the channel is, you know, that tag is taken because, you know, Chantal didn't, I either did, she either didn't read her email to make sure to get her tag, but yeah, someone else took it. Just like a makeup one. I don't care. It doesn't matter. I'm not changing my name back. It's verified now. Um, the plaque will have that name. So it's, it's a done deal. You're not, I'm pretty, I need to do a little bit of Googling. Hold on just to like, make sure. Can you? Get a YouTube plaque if your channel oops, was terminated. Just to make sure. Um, your channel is it isn't terminated or linked to an account that has been terminated. So that is from you like Google Help itself. So you are not eligible for a plaque. Thank you, Google. <laughs> if you had are you choose one shuisin? What do you mean, Beatrice? What's a shuisin? A cuisine? I probably look like Smeagol. Who said that? Hi, Z. Hi, sweet Marie. Congratulations getting verified and getting your very well deserved plaque. Thank you, Shelly. I appreciate it. Not that. eligible for a plaque, girly. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and you know that's the only reason why she did this. Not for the check mark. It's like a check mark. Who cares? She wanted that plaque to put in her background of all of her videos and show it off. But she, but she's not eligible for it though. Oh no. <laughs> Sorry. Try again. Thoughts? Yeah, last week blue pot. But a week is a long time for me not to do something, right? <laughs> A week is a long time in my Chantal timeline. I always look forward to being on here when you're live. I like that you actually respond to people and talk to us. I really appreciate that. I'm alone a lot. And all, all I got this world is my boyfriend. Oh, Lynn. Thank you. I'm alone a lot too, you know, mostly by choice. <laughs> and all I have is my husband, my cats, and, you know, family. And that's a lot for me. I'm happy. I'm thankful. So I'm thankful for you guys too. I really appreciate you guys. I'm just going to 
you know, huge grocery hauls, you know, I would not use the food bank. Um, if people really genuinely need it, then there's no shame whatsoever in having, a, you know, needing it and having hard times, especially like with inflation, exactly. You know, like being middle class and, and working full time is still like people are still not making it. You know, I've seen um, on the news people who are um, basically... No, it won't have Foodie Beauty. Foodie Beauty is dead and gone, Tracy. It's it's a new era now. <laughs> oh yeah, look at guys. It's a brand new era. Look at look at words. Look how much has changed. Look look how much she has changed and grown and just completely evolved her channel from complete bare bones to um, another pile of bare bones. Just wow, just a, a plus. So we've changed so much. We've gone so many places and done so many things since, you know, she's rebranded and yeah, just completely dead and gone, even though it's the same exact content. <laughs> Alpha C Tango. Hello. Oh, I didn't know that. Nosferatu. Nice. What are the numbers in the chat? What was I saying? <laughs> oh my gosh. So yeah, like I've seen on the news, uh, you know, some families like they can't even, you know, it's, I don't know. It's just, uh, it's just hard. So. <laughs> Blue pot, here come the conspiracy she's stealing from the poor. <laughs> yeah, sure. I don't think people put like bags and bags of uh, fresh groceries, new groceries in there. Maybe they do. Actually, maybe I will do that. Like, go through like food that, you know, I, I don't want it to go to waste. So, but not just that. Maybe I'll make like a nice little pack. Every single time she's like, oh, I'm going to be doing so many cooking videos with all of these vegetables. But then the last time she did that, quite literally, the the um cauliflower and broccoli or cauliflower and carrots there we go uh, was pretty much like pretty much within days of rotting and going bad so has great ideas just does not execute on any of them <laughs> they didn't go delivered or something i'm definitely going to be working more on um you know the charity side of um things you know especially being muslim that's like a huge pillar so you know, I, I believe now, like when you feel blessed, you should share with others. I've always been like that. I've always been generous. I gave away a whole laptop. Like, come on. <laughs> Which did she really though during Cuba? I don't know why we're going back to this, but eh, I don't think that was the case, girly. And on on top of that, is she going to mention? Um, I, I it was a few live streams ago. I think I might have skipped over, but she said it was for that guy's kid which I don't think anybody at that point had ever even heard about that version of that story, but. Okay. You know, I've, um, I'm very generous when I have. I want to give it. I want to share, you know, to people who don't have a lot. Okay. It says to the woman that was crying in Cuba about like, oh my God, all these people, they just work in this, they work for nothing pretty much. I just have so much money. And I just, I want to give it all away. Did not give a, a cent of it away. The only thing, only thing that she, she gave money to was food delivery and food in general. And wheelchairs. Don't forget about the wheelchairs, but just girly was making <laughs> girl was making uh, every single month more than a lot of people make in an entire year, and she has nothing to show for it. Wonderful, great job. Oh, voodoo! Thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate it. Awful, but like at the same time, oh pickle, pickle, pickle. What are we gonna? What words? Whatever are we gonna do with her? That bully. She paid your Pascal shame me one time. I'm still not over it. I'm still not over it, guys. I'm completely. I'm completely joking. By the way, if you're not on Twitter, it's a whole gag. <laughs> Highly recommend chicken pickles for your channel. <laughs> Oh, live, thank you so much for the super chat. And um, I can personally say that I never want to make cauliflower and um, carrot soup. So I can 100% agree with that. Yes. <laughs> you um, you can change your name, but it, the, the verification will go. So that's basically, um, yeah, like... You just have to reapply for it, though. Yeah, we've been bowling, Muto. There's a video of us bowling on our couple's channel. Made Miriam. 
That's what you're here recently or like that bowling video was like a year ago, year and a half almost. Like, what do you mean? I, it hasn't been any time soon that she's been bowling. What you looks like? <laughs> oh, the Disney Robin Hood. Oh, yeah. Remember the Robin Hood? I remember wanting to watch that as a kid and my mom wouldn't let me because it's so like rated R, you know? I remember like like my mom had some friends over they were going to watch it because it was a new movie. It was the one with Kevin Costner. They were going to watch it after I was gone to bed. So I kept, I went like snuck down like in like in, you, there's like holes in between the stairs so i would like try to peek and my- i'm just gonna there we go <laughs> it's not like somebody asked me for it i just gave it oh Pikachu. lord hold on i'm assuming the laptop uh, like ottawa history so sad no i didn't trade the laptop for anything uh like you sure about that because i'm pretty sure the story was like you know big be- because you guys did the eh, 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 um you gave him the laptop to do that am i wrong i i i honestly don't remember that much about cuba so okay then it's me for it i just gave it if you could choose the cuisine for the rest of life would it be american mine personally would be chinese I, I, I like Panda Express way too much, and no, I'm not going to be. Either that or, cho- like, Mexican because of Chipotle, though. Oh. Maybe Mexican because it's a little bit more versatile because you can have, like, just, I don't know. That's a really hard one. I don't know. Oh. Either one of those. I can't pick right now, but, like, either one of those. Uh, No, I wouldn't choose American cuisine, I don't think. I don't know. I'd have to think about that because I do like America. I love fast food. So, <laughs> and on top of that, she's quite literally the the lady that went from Canada back during the Panini to America just to get like Sonic and McDonald's and I'm pretty sure Burger King also at the same time, and then had trouble getting back to Canada because she had to take a 24 hour COVID test. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I, you sure about that, girl? You sure that you wouldn't choose American cuisine because uh, honestly, like a big portion of that is just like fast food chains so like burger king <laughs> wendy's mcdonald's all american but i guess if you're choosing from a health standpoint it should probably be something else <laughs> blue pot i love conspiracies aliens cryptids donald trump sentient rape oh <laughs> i mean fair but like also it's so worth it though <laughs> what a sentient wig <laughs> blue pot yeah true <laughs> hey cigarettes are freaking expensive it's not even cool oh i think my i forgot to put plug in my um computer so it's gonna die don't get off i have to cook dinner order dinner i'm just gonna do that again probably gonna be jumping around here in a bit because she's she's slowing down mia hello thanks georgia girl i appreciate it guys i'll do something special uh, one of these days 100k get verified oh I'll, I'll do something you know fun one of these days that's right it's delivered right onto her plate right on her lap here you go here's a great opportunity to do to do something fun special video and i'll do it later it's fine she will never learn i swear don't worry we haven't celebrated properly did you have a teenage heartthrob crush i think leo dicaprio and jtt I can't wear wigs, Desert Rose. I'm a hijabi. <laughs> I mean, I, I feel like all of mine were um, not real people slash cartoons. So, <laughs> Chicky Fingies, yes. Thanks, Gary. 24 hour live stream. Shakespeare, a, a 12. I was obsessed. Obsessed. <laughs> oh my gosh. And you know what's funny? I didn't even watch uh, Home and Birth. <laughs> Wait, there was one. There was... Oh, no. I'm going to get so much flack for this. For not... Uh, what is it? He's the guy that played Firefly, or played in Firefly, the main character. He was also in Castle. Oh, God. His name. The live-action Tarzan. Live-action. I cannot for the life of me remember his name. Uh... Oh, God. What was his name? And I, I still love him. That's the I'm, I'm really bad with celebrities and like movies, and I haven't seen the majority of stuff. To be fair. Okay, hold on, Google. Wait, oops, that's the wrong button. I don't want to open that. Uh Brendan Fraser. I didn't even open it up. Brendan Fraser. There we go. 
I saw the uh, live action Tarzan movie, and uh, <laughs> even though it was a bit after that, you know, still to this day, Brendan Fraser. Improvement. I didn't. Is that the name of the show? I didn't even watch it. Oh wait, no, not Brendan. Hold on. Was it Brendan Fraser? Nathan. Nathan. Nathan Fillion. There we go. Oh wait. Oh wait. Was it? Oh God. Hold on. Like I said, bad with um. Uh, hold on. Every single time. Every single time this happened. Uh, oh, no, no, not that one. Okay, okay, Nathan Fillion was, okay, wrong actor. I'll go, you, what's your name? What is your name? What is your name? Okay, Brendan Fraser. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> Brendan Fraser, that was it. Oh, is she live again? Oh, my. Oh, voodoo. Don't tell me that. <laughs> God. I didn't like it. You know? Hold on. It was weird. 10, 10, 10. <laughs> And Jared Leto from um, My So Called Life. That was my favorite. Oh my god! Oh my god! Why is she live now, again? She she's not currently live, but it's upcoming. Oh Chantal, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> oh, and she's showing her face in this one. So I like Jonathan Brandis. Oh yeah. I but also, it. thank you. Oh, good lord! But no, but thank you though. Um, I guess let's see and wait it out and see if she goes live while we're here. If not, uh, might either skip it or just wait until later. Do it. <laughs> I was just watching your video before anything that's a lot made me smile. Thanks, Victoria. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, I don't know. I think I'm gonna get off. Maybe if I can't sleep or something, I can go live again with my fake camera on. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I don't like also go why? why why are we going live multiple times a day and we're just waiting for her to go live still so um hmm well aren't we in the pickle <laughs> and yes she very much did rush to do something for her and on top of that Yes, all she needs is pizza. Just diabetic queen. Looking out for her health, doing things, and getting better. No, 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 no. We gotta celebrate the 100k that she definitely did not, you know, fa fabricate. Wink, wink. <laughs> Honestly, life, probably. She probably, probably thinks that is the pinnacle of Chinese cuisine right there. Just complete essence of the Chinese culture. <laughs> probably. Wouldn't be surprised. Oh, maybe. But then again, she usually does go live for around an hour. Is her usual go-to time hour, hour and a half. Um, if she's mad, probably a little bit longer. Still waiting for her to go live. Um, I guess let's play this out and see if she goes live. We have eh, about two minutes left. But, uh, hey, ba Bailey, hello. He has a call, so I'm not surprised. You liked Ashley Kutcher? <laughs> I never did. I don't know. Maybe it was because he was too goofy. I find that so unattractive when guys are like, I don't know, like, like it was just a character, but I don't know. Whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on. Isn't that your, like, man's 90% of his personality is being goofy? I don't know the said character, but, like, she really said that with her whole chest girl. <laughs> And on top of that, Miranda, she did. I, compl I completely forgot already. Yeah, she, ha she had, like, a foot long. And now she's eating pizza. But I cannot believe that she said with a straight face that she hates goofy guys when the, when her, the majority of her man's personality is is being goofy, huh? And like not even like a like a situational like he can kind of do it at like the perfect time to make it funny, but like annoyingly goofy, huh? Girl, uh huh. I don't know what he's like in real life, but I just never really, I don't know. Um. Okay, she is live. Give me one moment to set this up. <laughs> I'm not sure if you guys can hear her, but... Okay. 
Need to press you. And she looks really happy and just really excited to reach 100k, guys. Are you ready to see what Chantal's, you know, pizza party is going to be looking like whenever it comes to her? <laughs> whenever it comes to her um, getting this, um, this like, momentous occasion. There we go. That's the word I'm looking for. Doesn't she just look super happy to be here? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh, Chantal, never change. You never will, but I'll do it to 1.25 because she's still live and she just started, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, just completely happy, complete joy just oozing out of her right now. <laughs> <laughs> Darnay, you're always first. It's an accomplishment. Hey, Kara. Amy Thor, that's not playing. Hello, hi, Tiffany. Katrina, pizza. Somebody put it in my mind, and I'm like, okay, pizza celebration it is. <laughs> Bubbles and marshmallows. Hi, Wines Trends, Nostum, Tangerine. Okay. Oh, bye. Thank you so much for the super chat. Honestly, I at least with the, his singing, at least it's pre-recorded and you can skip through it. But with him being goofy, it's just kind of out of nowhere. You never really expect it, and it's more. No I'll, I'll take his singing personally. What the heck is that? Oh, hello, Bubbles. Hi, Millie. Thank you, Beezer. Check this out. Oh my. Jesus Christ, girl, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> oh my god, the health queen herself, just af after having a foot long, mind you, a foot long sandwich, no, with, not with flat bread, nothing that's like, you know, a little bit smaller than regular bread, no, big fluffy 12 inch sandwich with a bunch of toppings that she barely could keep in the bun is really oh, going to be out here eating the pizza. After eating breakfast on top of that also. Oh, Jesus Christ, girl, what are you doing? Oh, boy. Well, I mean, it's her, it's her health. You can't tell her anything, unfortunately. Hope it's worth it. It has a ranch on it. Pepperoni. Paulette, hello, Polly Dolly. There's pizza places open 24 hours, Brenda. Mac and cheese, yum. Hi, butthole surfer. Thank you, Vera. The slices for you guys. All right, let's eat it this cinema. No way. <laughs> oh, hey, Tammy. Hmm. Did you like it, Moth? All right, tomorrow we're gonna go on a diet. I'm serious. Oh, to... yeah. You know, the, the thing that you've been saying now for years now, I'm going to be changing. I'm going to eat better. I'm going to go on a diet. Yeah. How's that going so far? <laughs> God. Tomorrow. Thank you, DFX. And it's also not really helping because uh, I was just about to go make food, but like, um... <laughs> and also, I, I know that she's not eating the, 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 that pea, like the, crust like that like two bites in and re yeah but this is currently live i was just about to wrap up and be done here but then she scheduled a live um so here we are we're doing a two for one tonight <laughs> Oh, yep, Steffi, okay. just like like I just said, she scheduled she scheduled this right as I was just about to be done here. So Thank you, Katie. You're sweet. I know it looks so good, huh? Mm, it's flopping. The pepperoni here. Hello. It doesn't taste any different. Hi, Brandy. Thanks, Paula. Your toast, Kelly. We're gonna start Monday. Come on. 
Better food than the hospital. Hi, Trevonda. As long as you keep trying. Yeah. Hi, Bailey. Oh, Hi. yeah. I, I know that diabetes is going. Oh, thank God. I was really worried that you weren't going to be starting a diet here pretty soon. But since, you know, you know, you had uh, a foot long already and you had a uh, pretty sizable breakfast, I'm so happy and just I'm so glad that you're starting it Monday. That's fine. Don't, like, don't worry about it, girly pop. You're good. You're fine. As long as you're going to be eating better on you know, Monday, whenever the case might be, you're good. It's fine. Like, don't worry about it. You're good. Ma'am. Laura, you want a bite? <laughs> mm -hmm. Pepperoni, cheese, and ranch. I mean, Not the cheese. <laughs> Thank you so much. Remember the soluble fiber and eating good and having a really healthy breakfast. <laughs> Not the cheese. I'm happy. I'm really happy to have you guys. And, you know, kitty, yay. <laughs> Hi, Silvail. My eyes are watery. So I fell asleep waiting for the pizza. Oh, isn't that just a shame? Mm, sure he did. And also, girly, great job. Wishing you all the best. Oh, excuse me. And also, like, tell me the secrets of said nutrition nutritionist. <laughs> oh. For my next slice. And I will say that was ketchup. And I will say for without a fact, with my own unbiased opinion, ketchup on pizza is ungod well, no, godly slash one of the most amazing things that, that I personally have ever witnessed. And uh just try it. Just at least one bite of it, try it. It makes it taste more pizza-y. How, why, I don't know what the case might be, but it makes the pizza taste so much better. And I did not want to like it. I want to preface that also. I didn't want to like it. I was like, you know what? Fine, I might as well try it one bite. Life-changing. Pizza. <laughs> A little bit. Hi. I can't show you, Julia. Turn the camera around because... Oh, yep. She decided as I was finishing up to go live again. I couldn't tell you. I have all my Ramadan decorations. Oh, and also... Until we have and also, magically, Saw fell asleep while waiting for the pizza. Just magically and just happened to be... You know, like, wake him up to, so that way he can have some... Nah, have some sleep. It'll be fine. Set up. Do you wonder, gay? Well... Sorry, Bailey. <laughs> Hi, Rylan. Thank you. My other girl, Julia. She's so sweet. Hi, Candace. Thank you, Ashley's World. Rebe, thank you, guys. Thank you all. This type of thing should be celebrated with you guys because you got me here, right? Without you guys. But, like, also, uh, you, also on top of that, she's not even celebrating with her man. Like he, oh no, he fell asleep. Like, like you can not wake him up so that way he can be in the chat to celebrate with you. And said you're gonna let him sleep. <laughs> That's a really big choice there, Chantal. And that says a lot more than you allegedly. Even you know if if he's even there. To be fair, you know, Chantal, she loves to tell little white lies and say that she's not lying because we have no proof about it. But like you're not even celebrating with your man even though that's like half the celebration is because like you know you met your man and made this your entire life now this and that and the other this is one really kind of sad party if you really want to think about it you know we'll slide out easy but i do watch all your mukbangs i've been watching you since almost the beginning i'm gonna say you're amazing thank you elaine that means a lot really does. Sorry, Archer lady. I get it. Eating videos are not for everyone. Seriously. Oh, Blue, thank you so much for the super chat. And probably not to be, I mean, to be fair, I do like fall asleep at really not super great hours. So, I mean, if she really wanted to go for a few more hours, I would be fine. I might have to go like go get food and stuff, but like I should be okay. <laughs> Not proud of that either, but like at the same, it could be worse. But thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. Creepy comfort. Hi. 
sick and in and out of hospital. Have been haven't been on with you. Oh, I hope you're okay, Tiffany. I wish you well. Don't look at my visas are sick. Thirty three months. Thirty seven. Maybe you don't ever explain yourself. Brenda, what did you do in between? Mm. Hi, marbles. The Ramadan song. Yeah, you wanted to sing it for my video. Thank you, Lois. Kung Fu Panda. Did you guys hear Jack Black singing? Um, hit me, bit. Why do you, oh, you like olive, don't you? You like the olive BBs. When I was a kid, I, I called them olive BBs. Here, here. I don't think that olives are technically good for cats. I could be wrong about that, but just knowing Chantal's direction when it comes to animal care, I wouldn't be super surprised. But, uh, and also, yes, I did hear about that. And I kind of wish that there was a full version now. I don't know if there is, but like, it, he sounded really good. I'm going to put extra olives on my pizza because um, they never put enough. <laughs> My loneliness can follow me in love. Okay, Archer. Hi, me. They're doing the deep age. <laughs> oh, and then on top of that, I just realized that is the juice, and she's drinking it out of the thing itself and not even getting a glass. Girly. I need to, like, just make sure that's what I just saw. Okay, Archer. Hi, me, but they're doing the deep age. She is 100% just drinking straight up juice out of <laughs> the thing. Girl, come on. Give me a... I was not ready for this live stream. I don't know what I was expecting, but girl is just drinking ju straight up juice out of the garden. <laughs> I cannot. Oh, girl, I hope it's worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Me with the dirty mind always. Ramadan, Ramadan. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I can't wait to share the vlogs with you guys. Well, Sarah, I'm not sure if you came in maybe a little bit late, but um, it's lost there, allegedly. But like right as the pizza got there, magically magically he fell asleep so he can't be uh there eating, eating pizza right now magically just he just happened to be falling asleep right as celebrating with her man nah nah <laughs> god maybe you would have uh, laughed so much at him explaining properly what deep age is hi tracy here we go thank you ava Thanks, Laura. Will someone gift memberships? When, Marbles, just now? I can't see. Okay, so we have meat, olives, and more olives. Mushroom, and then, okay. Like a pepperoni pizza, I can see putting ketchup on, but I feel like that's kind of overkill with the ketchup, to be honest with you. And how many olives, Voodoo? Yes. How many? Yes. There's <laughs> How many olives? Yes. <laughs> Because whenever someone gifts, for some reason, on the mobile now, I can't see it. Um, Melly. Thank you, Queen. Wow, Rebe Marbles, who else got one? Thank you, Rebe. You're so sweet, really. Shukra to Zealand, my queen. Hi, Island Dragonfly. What's wrong with my mouth today? Can of olives for each slice. No, Brenda. Cheese steak subs are so good. I love them. If the steak is tough, ugh. Just... I like, like, what do you say to this? Like, honestly, like, Chantal, like, the pizza's not going to be going anywhere. It's okay. Take your time. Quit trying to fit in, like, 20 bites worth in one bite. It's okay. Don't worry. I, uh, I, anyways. Miss Craft, I got verified. My channel's verified now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Celebrated. After begging people to, to sub to your channel. Great job. My small life achievement. Anchovies, huh? Beat it. I'm starting again tomorrow, Blue Pot. 
the last pizza. Hi, Liz. Thanks, Creepy. Yeah, thanks, guys. I'm going to have one more pizza. I know I say that. And I sound like a fool. But I really... Uh, yeah, at least you... At least... <laughs> At least I don't have to say it. Yeah, yeah. One piece turns into two, two turns into three, three turns into four, and by you know, I've never done it myself. But before you know it, the entire thing's gone. So, oh lord, girl, I have no idea. <laughs> and also, I will also agree this is kind of weird, but like. Also, mainly the fact that Slav fell asleep magically right as the pizza came. It's just weird. Very odd. Have you? You know what I was going to make to eat tonight if I didn't order pizza and subs? Chicken liver. <laughs> Chicken liver. Oh, the dancing hamburger melee is on my, on my PC. My Academy Award. Thank you, Brandy. No, you can't have my ranch. All right, Elaine, I'll send you a piece. It's 4.30 a.m. there every day, Miriam girl. Thank you, Chantel's right awake. I know. It's my breakfast. Blue pot. <laughs> I make it good, though. Yeah, it's, they have stuff for us. I'm just right. gonna do that. Salah loves chicken livers, yeah. That's not where I thought that we were going to be going right after I did that, but uh, good to know, I guess. Thank you. It's popular here. You stir fry them with a bunch of spices so they don't taste like liver. <laughs> Breakfast pizza. I love hot wings. I wish I got wings, but... Yum, DFS. Ryan, my Friday's going okay. How was yours? So. Chantal does. <laughs> it was a very bad <laughs> diet day. Oh, yeah. I can't imagine having basically roughly around two breakfasts, eating a 12 inch, and then on top of that, for you know, 4 30 in the morning, gonna be eating allegedly. I think it is, right? Going to be having a pizza. What time is it in Kuwait? Oh. What time is it in Kuwait? The time in Kuwait is 4.48 a.m. Yeah, 4.48 a.m. She's eating, and I, not even just like a cheese or pepperoni, no, like a fully loaded pizza, so... <laughs> Yeah. I'm starting again tomorrow, Blue Pot. Thanks, Laura. That's sweet. Yeah, I have I should have a tick by my name now. Thanks, Brooke. Well, my blood sugar is like I only start feeling sick when it gets to like maybe 23 or something, but it hasn't been like that because of my medication. And which, from what I know, twenty three is still very bad. Like even in the like the tens, it's still pretty bad. So I'm gonna go off on the limb and say allegedly that like her, her blood sugar has not been super great here here recently. Hence why she's been feeling super like lethargic. Okay, so um, I was right. I'm assuming twenty three is not good. It's not funny, but just like at the same time, like. It's ridiculous. It's still early where you guys are, though, eh? I know all the fresh groceries. I'm going to eat them. Don't worry. I hope not, Brooke B. Just look up your food. Uh-uh. <laughs> the lowest it's been is like eight. Hey, Sylvia. 
I didn't make this pizza at home. Thanks, Wayana. 743. Doesn't all that junk food in your meds make you uncontrollable? Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> I will. I'll make the chicken livers tomorrow. <laughs> Hi, Carrie Lynn. And she's words giggling, so I'm not having super high hopes. Will we will we get a video? Probably not. <laughs> Pine berries, comic book. What? Good pizza places are always expensive. I know what you're about. Queen Nelly, what did call it? On top of that, what brand is that pizza? She didn't like specify about like where she bought that from. Girlie, where is that from? Let us know. <laughs> I mean, you're you're you know uploading on YouTube, so it's kind of you know pointless at this point to even kind of be insinuating that you're <laughs> boycotting. But like, where's that pizza from? I'm very interested. Did Melly give more people? You had them missing. If somebody does, oh, let me know, please. <laughs> um, oh, I'm not sure if you saw it uh, earlier on, but she was drinking it out of the uh, the the actual bottle that the juice comes in. You're welcome, <laughs> Melly. Who got the gift? Thank you, Lois. Oh, Thanks, I can't Nitty. find it. I can't find it. Oh, yep, right there. Okay, blue. It's okay. <laughs> Comment April Dawn. Oh, congrats. Right. Thank you, Melly. And yes, yeah, this is this is semi well live. We're, <laughs> we're a little bit behind. Are you turning 25? Embrace it. Embrace it. I don't want to say the name of the pizza place, JRF, because people will harass it. Either that or it's just the fact that um hmm. It's from a bigger named company that she's alleging that she's going to be boycotting, but probably isn't. Either, either one's possible. But if it is like a more local place, that's smart. But I should probably stop showing labels and things. So vital. It's just a, it's called the Supreme Pizza. They call like anything mixed. <clears throat> with sausage and green peppers and olives. And with all okay, well, I mean, if it is a smaller place, you're pretty much giving everyone ammo to go try to find it, which I don't agree, nor condone people doing that, but she, she's pretty much just giving information out to, to be able to find this place. For for someone that's been on YouTube for seven years, you really think at this point Chantal would learn, but she never does. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, I'm GFS. That sounds good. <laughs> Meep what? Hi, right, easy. Hey, Moondog. I have water in the freezer. <laughs> Was Julia in the background? I didn't notice. I didn't notice you because, because, because. Because, because I'm skipping over this break, I don't want to hear BB talk, especially when it comes. Oh, she left. Whenever it comes to Julia, oh, she, yep, yep, she is. She's, she's a gong girl. There she is. Beauty and Grace just completely just glided in super swiftly and just sat down so elegantly, guys. <laughs> Girl. This is not like the uh, the kitchen chair, Chantal. You can't just death drop into a chair like that. Come on. The last time that she did that, she actually put a hole in the villa floor. Hey, Rojo. What did I miss, guys? Oh, and yep, she is. <laughs> yeah, I ate a lot today. Hi, 
and a loverly. Derpy turf. You might, Shelly. Mm. Emotional. All right, I just went to go skip forward and we're drinking more juice. Is that the same juice? I don't know. Yep. Okay, so... Um, the majority of that juice is not in the bottle. I can only imagine where it went. Um, I'm really hoping that it didn't go all into her body. I hope that that's the case. Cause, uh... But yeah, she's currently drinking juice right out of the bottle. Out of the bottle, the, the juice comes in. So... That's where we're at in the story. I hope everyone's having a great time. <laughs> I did not think that we can get any further, I don't know, down south or wherever the case might be. But here we are. And I'm, I'm trying my best to try to make it as pleasant to sound as it is. <laughs> okay, so let's see where this is going to go because... Uh, anyways... <laughs> Emotionally, yeah. But I feel depressed at that pizza is not healthy for you. Oh my god, congratulations. Something that we learned in like second grade. Pizza's not healthy food. Woo! Congratulations, you finally learned it. Anyways, sorry. I had to. I'm very sorry. Oh well, what can you do? Uh not eat the pizza. You're welcome. <laughs> Anyway, I saved more than a half for salon pizza. Okay, so she ate more than, okay, so she maybe ate two or three slices, allegedly. Then again, we're not seeing said pizza, so it's hard to tell. So, hmm, I got a lot of questions. Yo, let's get like half and half. I'm making mm -hmm. sure this is my last shisha. I don't know what to do about Shisha. I really love it so much. Oh, girl, that sounds good. I apparently was muted about that. Sorry about that, but um, we're... Yeah, we're just, apparently her last shisha was, like, the last shisha, but, like, this one now, this new one is allegedly going to be the last one. I know it's not healthy. <sighs> okay, what should I drink? The most popular not juice of... from the, not from the jug. That would be a great first step as to not what not to drink. Pizza here, or margarita. But for them, margarita is just plain cheese. There's, like, no basil or anything on it. Um... Like to me, margarita pizza has like basil and you know, I don't know. It's you know what I mean. <laughs> wow, DFS. No, I'm not crying. Are you feeling stressed? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> but I always feel stressed. When I was about to say, like, where are you feeling stressed about, girl? You just hit 100k, even though you had to like lie and pretty much beg people to sub for 100k. But like, that's that's besides the point. Like, why would you be stressed? Your man's asleep, not being able to get any cel celebratory pizza. Why are you stressed about? Like, why are, you, why are you stressed? And I have to, like, make important changes in my life or do something, you know, that involves me getting out of my comfort zone. You know what it is? I feel like... <clears throat> How do I explain it? I just feel like I have a lot of, like, um, things to do. I'm not used to doing a lot of... Teardrop! Oh, thank you, sweetie. You didn't have to do that. Cook. I showed it in my video. I made. Um, what kind of sub do you like there? What did I cook? I showed it in my video. I made breakfast. Um, and I made. I had overnight oats. I love those. Thank you, teardrop. Um, yeah, like just being like a domestic goddess, like I said. <laughs> you know, taking care of the house. Um. Wow, like the most bare basic thing the majority of like, you know, adults do. Anyways. Like if you look up in culturally, like, you know, Arab homes or Muslim Arab homes, 
you know, the woman has certain roles and do like stuff like that. And like Salah is very open-minded and so open-minded, so he's very lenient and he's very helpful. Okay. I don't want to say that, but he has his own responsibilities and things. And see though, because whenever you were having a lot of trouble with your leg stuff, right? Whenever you were complaining about like your legs and this and that and the other, like he couldn't even be bothered as to help you with um like the kitchen at all. For like a day or two, like he just didn't do it. So he's like, ah, I'm full. You know. <clears throat> so, yeah. It's just been like weird for me to be in that. I've always been like the one who's always like, I've just been so used to being so independent and just like worrying about myself and just like, you know. And I feel like now I have like a house. It's like my household, my kitchen, and I have to take care of it and take care of my home and stuff. And, you know, take care of a husband. I don't know. Do you know what I mean? My place looks very nice. Thanks, I try. My kitchen's a bit of a... Even game. though um, your man is the one that redecorated that whole entire place, but yeah, anyways, besides that point. Disaster since the rice pudding debacle. Okay, uh, fold me up. Uh, <laughs> Love the name, but um, essentially um, she was live earlier as I was finishing up here. She went live again. She had pizza. Well, then she had pizza, and then on top of that, she decided to drink juice out of the bottle. I'm not exactly sure if I can get that. Oh, there we go. Right there. So, and you're all cut up. <laughs> oh, and Blues, thank you so much for the super chat, and girls sleep well. Oh, but the pot is soaking. Domestic goddess, yeah. Domestic goddess. <laughs> You want me to test my blood? No, first. Also, please, I, I would highly suggest that you do that, but like also, girl, yeah, no, no one else think that's that's cute. I'm sorry. Trigger right now? I will. <laughs> it's not a joke, but. <sighs> Garlic sauce. You ain't had either since. Hi, Ghostface. Mahaba Ali Wasalan. Right, yes. girl, come on. Thrillo, that is what's making the whole rest of my life hard. That's what makes keeping up with housework, keep going outside to get things like even shopping today to get these Ramadan things. I was like, <sighs> I don't know if it's because I'm taking so many NSAIDs. Like, Olfin is like the clone factor. No, it's not about the fact that you quite literally just drink juice out of the bottle and also just ate a pizza or something. Like, I, I can't imagine why, with your very dainty diet and your very like healthy lifestyle that you lead, like, why you would be so um, fatigued. Just a complete mystery. Couldn't tell you. Feel I don't know about anyone else if they've taken this, but it's like an anti inflammatory, but it's super strong. But it's also an analgesic and it actually works on numbing my, the pain in my leg. For a long time like right now i don't feel it mashallah and like i know i could say oh i'm gonna change tomorrow i'm gonna change tomorrow it's so easy to say and then when i wake up i panic i'm like oh <laughs> like a huge baby like i then go get help then if you can't do it on your own i'm so sick and tired of her just complaining about everything being wrong not being able to do it well it's not like there's doctors or anything that specialize and study the majority of their adult life to help people like you or anything that's willing you know of course you have to pay naturally but just it's not like that they're not there to help you you the only person that can really help Chantal and at this moment before it's too late, unfortunately, I wouldn't wish that upon her is Chantal. That is the only person that can help Chantal in this very moment. And it's all on her. Like she, I mean, she can do it in the name of her husband, the name of her cat, like her mom, like whatever the case might be. She, she could do that, but she, she's the one that has to initiate it. People can't do the work for her, but Chantal will never understand that. Like, no matter how much therapy I need or whatever, I have to make a change now. So I really, really have to try again. Like I said, you you have to want it to begin with. That's the big difference. Tomorrow, guys. It makes, does it make me feel out of it? It makes me feel a bit dizzy. Yeah. Not like out of it brain fog, but let's go prank him. Hello, Bali. A three pieces of dove chocolate. Yeah, dove chocolate is so creamy. Okay, what should I have? Should I have this? Um, no name brand, no Arabic brand. On top of that, we three and one. 
I mean, we're going we're going to be having coffee on top of all that at like five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure if she just got up or she is she not slept yet, but whatever the case might be, more sugar, yay! Sort of Laura secret hot chocolate or instant Arabic coffee. So sugar, <laughs> sugar, or sugar. I just can't imagine which one that we're gonna, we're going to be going with. <laughs> it's a crying shame. That's awful being dizzy. Yeah. Will Ramadan and Iftar make it harder? No, I'm hoping it'll be easier because it'll be such a routine, you know, like a forced routine. <sighs> that I have to really try to, you know. Last year I did it, but like, Salah was not having me stray. So <laughs> like, I can't eat, like I wouldn't eat in front of, you know, but I really didn't have that much trouble because we can have Sahur, you have a big breakfast and you're not even that hungry till, till Iftar, you know? Yeah, I'm taking Olfen, O-L-F-E-N. Yeah, Lois. Hey, Sophia Rose. Do you have anything like you? Hot chocolate and water. And also, I've never been that kind of person to do hot chocolate with milk. I, I, I prefer it with water. Come at me. I'm one of those people. I'm very sorry, but just, it, it doesn't taste the same. It doesn't, it doesn't taste as good, in my opinion, at least. But I'll be like wired. Chocolate and coffee? Who's Mr. B? You don't have to fast if you have diabetes. We need our time. I know, Robin, but that's why. Come say hi. Oh, uh, she left again. She's gone. She's gone. She's really gone. She's still gone. Where'd she go? Oh, oh, there we go. I'm assuming this is the stuff that she got to decorate with, which I mean, hey, go for it. Why not? I just want to see how, like how she comes in, <laughs> to be honest, because the first time it was so dainty. Oop, my button, so dainty, so elegant. Oh my gosh, this is supposed to be for how, but he climbs it. So I want to see how Julia likes it. Also, on top of that, why is there a soccer ball in the living? I have a lot of questions. Why is there just a random soccer ball that just like that came out of nowhere? <laughs> soccer ball. Oh, yeah. Okay, I also can see uh, Steffi. I'm assuming she says something about this being for Howie, but then she's going to see how Julia likes it. So I'm kind of. I'm kind of just as confused as everyone else. It's just kind of like a tent thing. And she's leaving again. <laughs> Where, oh, Julia likes it at least. That's fun. Okay, love that for us. There we go. Julia's still in the thing. Oh, okay. here she is. Yeah, I don't see that chair lasting that much longer, if I'm being quite honest with you. She thinks you can't see her. Mm. It only took like a few months, but we're finally finally acknowledging the fact that her husband allegedly works for a perfume business. Yay! It's only been like it's been a long time. And also, take note: she's using it as perfume. Whenever someone says something else about it, it's gonna it's gonna change to perfume like, to furniture spray. Just watch. But she's putting it on herself for now. So keep that in mind. This is disgusting. I need to remember how I feel. So she was. She got up. 
was gone for maybe a few minutes and she sat back down and she is like completely inebriated. I don't know if it's inebriated the right word. I don't know. She's, she's completely out of breath and can barely function girl. I'm out of breath. I had to wrestle with the potatoes. <laughs> oh God. It's not a litter box. Okay, hold on, guys. I'm gonna do my blood sugar. <gasps> We're actually getting it. We're getting it. I, I I thought that she I thought words I forgot I thought that she forgot about it. We're doing it. We're actually doing it. <laughs> I didn't pick. I need more of these lancets. Okay, so I'll have to get some of those. I'm gonna just in case if someone finds this kind of icky, I'm just gonna skip forward just a bit. Like right about there. No, I don't want I'm full. I don't want to finish the hey Blondie Barso. Cassidy, thank you. Ow. Hair out. Okay. Oh. Okay. Hold on. Is it? I'm so okay. So this one doesn't have a cracked screen, but like the screen, I'm so. I know. I'm sorry. I'm preventing us from seeing what the number is, but no cracked screen. But also the screen is also damaged on this one as well. Why? Where is the original one? Why is this screen also damaged? And there's no crack. I have a lot of questions. I have very a lot of questions. Thirteen point three. It's kind of broken. And I would definitely get an, another one because I don't trust that screen. Screen, but thirteen point three, which is kind of high. Which I do not know about diabetes, but like if you know about MMOL slash whatever the case might be, um, let me know because I have no idea. It's pretty high. My okay, well, <laughs> okay, since these are the two comments <laughs> that comes up, <laughs> three, <laughs> I'm assuming that that's not good. Yeah, there's multiple people saying, <laughs> I completely forgot about, like, what's good and what's bad. I have no idea. I'm assuming that it's, <laughs> it should, oh, God. It should be under okay. Well, that explains everything. It should be under five, and Lordy help us. <laughs> okay, so should be under five is currently double that, and then some. Uh, God help us all is all I have to say. I'm a oh oh boy. Um, Jamie, thank you so much for letting us know. Ooh. Oh, lordy, 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 lordy. Ooh. Whew. Okay. Of all that medication, whatever it is you're taking, girl, is it can only do so much. It can only do so much. Oh, okay, because I remember whenever she went to the ER, it was like 300 something. Okay, well, that's not too, too far off then. She, oh, that's also true. She just ate. Oh, God. Uh, Chantal, all I got to say is God help you. God help you. Jesus Christ. Willow Creek, thank you. And it's also not funny, but like, because I kind of was laughing, but just like for that to be the immediate reaction, I was not expecting. So I just also wanted to clarify that up. Oh, and hold on. Oh, her blood sugar. Oh, there we go. Uh, her blood sugar rating was 13.5 and it should be under five. So that's, that's what's high. And also, hello, welcome. Okay, what do you think? Would you guys think 
and be honest with me. You, you don't have to be, you know, I won't hate you. I want you to be honest. You don't think that I can do a six pack arc, do you? Okay, well, number one, no. Also, she uh, she ate pizza, and then on top of that, oh, no, you were there for that. Um, she did her blood sugar reading, and it's thirteen point five when it's um, supposed to be under five. So, there you go. You're all cut up. It's just the screen blue pot. I mean, I don't know for sure, but same. Claire, because I just ate. Thanks, Willow Creek. Well, my tiny. Thank you. Hope you're having a great Saturday. Thank you. One more tenny. Thank you for the super chat. Blood pressure hurts. Thank you. You'll never have a six pack. Six pack. I think I will. I think I will. Yeah, I got to get the mine right. That's the problem. It is high, yeah. I'm just curious after I eat how much it is. Fasting, it's usually 8, 8.5, between 8 and 10. 50 pound arc before six pack. I know, I have to start slow. Oh, I'm impatient. <laughs> Millie. <laughs> it's not reasonable, yeah. Okay, here's how I would have to get a six pack. First, I would have to nail the weight loss, lose all the weight, get skin removal surgery on my tummy, and then like, you'll see it. I just have to do a whole bunch. I used to have an ab master, you know, this ab or ab roller. I wanna get one, I saw one on Timu. And she's actually being serious about this, talking about like a six pack. And she saw ab roll on Timu right after she just ate all of that. And her blood sugar is like almost like I is well slash is ICU level. And now she just the madness never ends here. I oh god. Anyways, ugh. yeah, I know comment how it is. <sighs> Georgia girl, specs of heel. Hello, great to see you. You too. Do a bodybuilder arc. <laughs> I poison ivy. I don't think there's Muslim bodybuilders. <laughs> Blue pot. Creepy comfort. Oh, thank you. More for. <sighs> it's like part of my routine. It's like cold. Lemony, minty air. I don't feel any tobacco. That's why it's dangerous, because you smoke more than cigarettes. But do you love breathing? I don't love it, but I have to do it. Um, do I want to ask? Am I, I also kind of feel the same way about sleeping. I don't, falling asleep, I hate sleeping. I love waking up. It's not my favorite thing, but like it's a lot better than trying to fall asleep, but just... That's not a little bit morbid. I don't know what it is. I mean, I wonder if Shisha will like. Yeah, you're right. I have asthma. The pool. Yes, Golden Girl. My pool will be filling up soon. Well, that's nice, Georgia girl. Hi, Megan. I became a member. Welcome, Megan Bernard. Ready, set, beast. Ready, set, beast. <laughs> yeah, she's not going to take this seriously, unfortunately. As much as I want her to, um, it's just it's going to get worse before it gets better. And uh, she really doesn't. Have, she on. I hate saying this, but like she really doesn't have that much more leg room to work with when it comes to um, getting worse. Unfortunately, just I don't know. Just girl, go get hell. This is just embarrassing at this she's point. Back, so. Adrum, okay. uh, ghost face. Wolf Pop, hi, new here. Really enjoying your journey. Walking is wonderful. Can you get a leash for your kitty? <laughs> I don't know, Wolf Pop. That's a good question. But there's a lot and of also, the sad part is, is like she knows. She knows everything. She went to the ER back in, I, I think it was January, about having high blood sugar and went and had stuff done. And she got an insulin shot and she was going to be changing all of this and that. But then she ran back here. So I hate saying that there's no help for her, but like at this point, my my hope is starting to dwindle, and that 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 hope is pretty much um, pretty much a, a a particle at this point. There's nothing to it. So fair. I don't want them to attack her. <laughs> Thank you and welcome, welcome to the uh, welcome to the circus. <laughs> yeah, Emily, he does like he doesn't even really care about unhealthy food that much. I mean, I know he has a lot of sweets, but. 
kids are crying. Oh, happy birthday, March babies. Yes, happy birthday to you and your daughter. The whole month, it's the rules. Yes, okay. <laughs> what, Ellie? When you grocery shop, don't buy things you can't resist. Yeah, true. Yeah, I know, chatty crafter. But you know what? Um, what was I gonna say? I don't buy any, like this grocery haul, I didn't buy any snacks or anything. And then I end up ordering because I cry that there's nothing to eat. Okay, so the forever victim, trying to change her life for the best, but yet cries whenever that there's no food that she can eat. She she will never, she'll never get it, unfortunately. Oh, Lori, thank you so much. I appreciate it. And then, <laughs> I love your name, by the way. Fold out McPunche, yes. And also, on top of that, yes, yeah, she sips water by close juice. Hey, anything to get that fixed, I suppose. What I've seen. You have many that love you. Thank you, Georgia girl. I know it really means a lot. Yeah. Say it with your chest. Yeah, I'm not doing terribly well today in any aspect. Okay, wow. Also, on top of that, this is supposed to be like a happy celebra celebratory day, and yet she's down in the dumps, girl. Why? Why? And also, why did you have to have a pizza party? Mama Tane. Oh, thank you for you. <laughs> on top of that, <laughs> not the I forgot about the carrots. You're so. <laughs> I can't have too many of them because. <laughs> <laughs> they're really high in sugar but then like it has entire pizza and just everything else yep gotta worry about those pesky carrot sugars don't you worry she's on top of it the stickers are so cute thank you mama to me i appreciate that <laughs> no bubbly thank you mama to for the super chat you know a lot about arabic it goes face more than me <laughs> No bubbly. Not that I've seen. If they have, it's like super expensive because it's imported. The blood reading was 13.5 or 13.3 or something. Now, on top of that, I don't know why she doesn't. Girl, go home. This is embarrassing for everybody involved. Your mother, uh, your family, you, your man, you know, even though your man couldn't even stay awake. Uh, which kind of insinuates that she's still up or she's still um she hasn't gone to bed yet allegedly because he fell asleep at like almost six o'clock their time so did he fall asleep and she's beezing without him knowing or something i don't know but she sure as hell ordered food let me tell you thanks georgia girl okay tomorrow will be a health vlog Mind changer, yeah. Well, Robin, I'm used to eating like takeout like twice a day sometimes. So for me, it's like, literally, it's like an addiction. I'm skipping forward a bit. You're, yeah, your sister has the same birthday. It's so, that's so cool. Your... <laughs> He's always trying to help me. Do you want me to order those diet boxes for you, the prepared meals? I'm going to order them for you. It'll make it so much easier on you. Um, you know. I mean, at least it at least he's attempting to help, even though that's not necessarily helping. But, like, I guess in Chantal's case, like, that would be the best kind of solution for her, even though that she'll claim, like, oh, my gosh, I'm so full, guys. Like, it's just it's so much food. But then, like, a weekend, she's crying because there's not enough food, and she's really hungry, and she ends up eating more food that's outside of the boxes. But I mean, it's just... I don't know if like the diet boxes honestly can't do it for you anymore, Chantal. Like what will? Like the thing that's pretty much like foolproof is not working for you. What what's going to be the solution here? Because you you can't do it on your own, unfortunately. 
Oh, Jamie, thank you so much for becoming a member. I appreciate it. Let's get a cleaner. He's always trying to help me. The diet boxes, yeah. But they weren't, like, enough. Like, I don't know. I was still starving. And they're expensive for what? Like, and they're not, I don't know. They give you a lot of rice and those diet boxes too. Brittany, hi. How you doing, girl? Oh, Connor, girl, of course. I hope that um I hope that you start feeling better soon, but like <laughs> it's not this funny, but just like out of all the like the live streams to, to for this to you kind of be on. I'm sorry that's this one, but you know, I hope I hope that you feel better soon, girl. I'll have to eat less. Yeah, I know. It's not cheap to diet. I have been eating a lot of carrots. I love carrots with like, but I like them with cheese. Like little, the little cream cheeses. I slice the carrots in little coins and I put little drops of the cream cheese on them. Oh, good Lord, girl. You just had pizza. You just had... <laughs> Currently, just after eating food, it's going to be talking and lusting over more. Girl, shh. Uh, oh, Jesus. Okay, I, let me see if she's even still alive. Is she? Nope, she, she's still alive. Oh, really, Davey? Donuts, yeah. I haven't had a donut in a long time. They have these donuts here. Like, remember? I think I showed one. Simpsons donuts, and they're, like, this big. <laughs> well, uh, okay, wonderful. We're still talking about food. Oh, God. Um... Well, that's a pause screen for me to take a screenshot with if I've ever seen it. I that was a complete accident. Yeah, that's. I can't tell if she's yawning or is she like trying to do like a tree lady voice or something. <laughs> I guess I don't know. What's the um? What's the deal here? Is she yawning or is she making a a thing? I I'm assuming that she's yawning. Oh, yeah, I was right. She was yawning. I know. My makeup is going to smudge because I have watery eyes, always. Allergies, tiredness, and um, makeup irritates my eyes. should just not wear it, but I look dead. Every single day. Gonna start tomorrow. Gonna start next week. Gonna start in a few days. Never happens. Too pretty for that. It's so bad. Oops, I muted her. <laughs> Sorry. I slept weird times. Like last night, I went to bed at like 3 a.m., woke up at 8, and then I went to sleep again at 8 p.m. because I just couldn't, like, I couldn't stay awake anymore. I needed a nap, probably from the pain meds. I don't know, from the, just like being tired also. And then I woke up at 1. <laughs> hey, Trishy's fish. Random commercials, like, like more than every time. Chantal for stalking. What was it, Brittany? No, I don't have ketone things, CB. One step at a time. But like, I can't get out of that mindset, all or nothing. You know what I mean? I can't do it. We got it. Well, I then just... I don't know. Start with all, then. If if you can't get it out of your system, and like, just go ahead and do it. And don't question it, and don't cry about it. Just go ahead and do it. That'll be the best for her, but she never will think slow and I say okay I'm just gonna eat three meals today and even though it's still like you know cut out one thing I feel like if I'm not doing completely fully clean like hardcore I don't feel like I'm doing good at all okay well I, I feel like that's like her biggest issue because I mean not every single skinny person which I cannot um confirm or deny because I am not said skinny person I like food too okay but like I'm not you know 350 400 whatever pounds um but it's not just a bunch of like asparagus with a very plain piece of chicken breast with no seasoning on it 24 seven. I feel like that's a big issue for her. <laughs> and then I just sabotage myself. Like today you see my video, I start out. Okay. Oh yeah. I just smudged. Um, I had overnight oats and then like a healthy lunch and brunch homemade with eggs and stuff. I felt like that was junk food. So I didn't want it because there was potatoes in it and like cheese and, Hey girl, you can still have those things, but I mean, in your case, I would limit them. But like, also, 
She said breakfast, but then brunch, lunch, but then like wouldn't brunch kind of insinuate breakfast because breakfast and lunch means brunch. So, uh, but <laughs> oops. So I just like whatever, honey, whatever today. And that, my dear, is how you end up with a 13.5 blood sugar rating. So, great job. I promise you, hands down. Yeah, choose your heart. Yeah. Restless leg syndrome is the worst. I used to get that. Hi, MM. And I figured it was from gravel. And then, like, um, also, Benadryl gives me that. Here, Brittany. Wow, just eight restless arms. I hate that you feel like you have to move them all the time. Should say that was true. I support your girls, but you do You've been abuser for a while. Thanks, Alana. Keto acidosis. Welcome back, golden girl. Self aware. Yeah. I am aware, you know, what I do is not good for me. Why do I still do it? It's complicated, like, you know. Because you're defiant even with yourself. You don't want to, you, you want to change, but like, you know, doing, uh, doing the work to actually change, you don't, you don't want to do that because with her and Amber, both they've made being big, their whole entire personalities, right? Like, like, I mean, honestly, like what would their content be if they weren't big, like their actual personalities? Oh my God. Like, how dare you personality, actual characteristics. Ugh, I wouldn't do that. I just want to be complaining about being big 24 seven. That, that seems to be paying the bills just fine. Why would I change? But then at the same time, they also want to be these like role models and they just want to be the example of people about losing weight and they finally did it, but yet they never want to do the work for it. So that is the biggest oxymoron I've ever seen emphasis on the moron part, but you know, you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> That's what having a food addiction is like, you know. Thanks, Kimberly. Welcome. You feel sleepy? Really, Golden Girl? Thanks, Brittany. Just like in Canada, when the green, it's hard to avoid, you know. <laughs> It addressed the all or nothing thinking. Really, bread and butter? Okay. I watched one called Brain Over Binge. I read one called Brain Over Binge. It's been a coping mechanism for, yeah, for a long time, exactly. Oh my God. Okay, like great. Love that for you. Apply it to do better. Will she ever? No, unfortunately not. Like a comfort. I don't know what the temperature is right now. Okay, well, I guess let's see currently. Um, hold on. No, I move or move. I can't. I can't see you. But what's the temperature in Kuwait right now? It's sixty degrees in Kuwait right now. Okay, with sixty degrees, you're welcome. <laughs> I don't know if they have rehab center here, but if I go to sleep, I yawn and can't get comfortable. Hmm. Okay, golden girl. Yeah. Oh, heavy! Thank you so much for stopping in, and have a wonderful sleep, girly. Yeah, if you have uh, restless legs, can I borrow a feeling old meat? Sure. My eyes—they're called frog eyes. No, <laughs> yeah, they're like a frog color. Thank you. Um, they're oh. called brown, which might be a little bit of a touch of hazel, oh. but they're yeah, they're pretty. Yeah, a little tiny hint of green, but like primarily brown they're not emerald green they're not blue they are brown which nothing wrong with brown eyes brown eyes are beautiful but just for some reason she wants so badly for some reason to have the characteristic of another eye color than what she has the weirdest thing i mean i have blue eyes so i mean i can kind of see where she's coming from but like i just just stick with stick with what you got it's fine But hazel has yellow in them, don't they? 31 Fahrenheit? Oh my gosh. In Florida, huh? You should center your daily prayers around asking God for the strength. Yeah, I know. I do, Toby, you know, but I, not all the time. I don't ask all the time. When I went to New York, I um went to New York City. 
My grandfather at the time lived in Albany, so I stayed with them. Okay, whoa. Well, okay, where did we get Grandpa going to New York from? I have a lot. Just, we went from talking about praying to God about giving strength to uh, eat better to Grandpa in New York. That I've been here. Did I miss something? <laughs> Ooh, girl, jealous. Well, primarily because you have a man, but like that seems beautiful. And also, yes, therapy. And then we took like a train, like into the city. I remember taking a train. And, um, yeah, and then where else did we go? I don't know. I was kind of like, I think, how old was I? Um, it's going to do that. Beautic. I know. They smell like, I don't know what they smell like. They have a cat smell. I feel like I cry so much whenever I see so much hate that is said about you. I've been following you since the pink bow tie nails. <laughs> Thank you, MM. All those nails are cool. I mean, honestly, if you're crying about some random person that gets hate on the internet, you might want to, I don't know, log off and try to get some hobbies or get some help or something. Like, I, I, I mean, I can feel bad about, like, feeling bad for somebody, not necessarily Chantal, but just, like, I don't know, feeling bad for somebody for whatever the case might be. But, like, if it's, a, if it's to the point to where you're crying over it, I, eh, hobbies might be a good uh, alternative. I didn't go to a Sonic in New York. Oh, um, Watertown, yeah, I did. Oh, and then you don't have to feel sad for me. Thank you. I hate that the, the people would set you that much. And also not suggesting about like logging off or uh, not worrying about it. No, just sorry about that. Goes to smoke is you no, know, if nothing just happened. So the white cube vegetables. Or pickle, pickle radish. Pickle, pickle radish, old meat. Thanks, Golden Girl. Yeah, it's true, bread and butter. It's not spicy, you know. I think it's like a daikon radish or something. Uh... Little right now, you know. Okay, kind of close to the end. Exactly. Which would be more interesting than what? The, who are you talking about? Oh, I love gas smell. <gasps> I mean, if we're talking about like gasoline, um, I agree. <laughs> as bad as it is for you, allegedly, but like the smell, I love the smell of gasoline. I don't know. I'm weird. I'm very. I'm very sore. I'm. I'm quirky like that. I like the smell of gasoline. <laughs> Anything mechanical, Soleil. So hanging out in a garage when they're doing oil changes would be like hell for you. No dessert. Ugh, I can't. And also, Jamie, girl, when are we not talking about food? <laughs> always, forever and always. Tapioca pudding. Root bag of fries. Ooh, that sounds good. I love the smell of gasoline, too. <laughs> I always unroll the window like... Like the carburetor fluid. Oh, it's strong though. I don't have any ice cream. Fatima, have you asked your doctor about Ozempic? I used to be on Ozempic when I was in Canada. It did help, but I haven't asked about it again. But Salah brought it up to me. So I might go back on it. I might ask about it in the next appointment, which I have to go see <laughs> go see the, the doctor. Vix. Oh. It helps your anxiety. See, Vicks makes me think of being sick because I always used to get rubbed with that on my chest. Okay, love that for you. So watering eyes, though, girl. It might be a sign to wash the makeup off or something. I don't know. Or maybe get a new, a new eyeliner, new eyeshadow, because whatever the case might be, it's not working for your eyes. My hair is long. It's like to here enough. What do you say in focus? Yeah, when I was a kid, yeah. So I'm more self-aware. 
Do you think maybe watching reactors? I don't watch them though. No, I don't think so. You don't, but like you know everything what about everyone's talking about and this and that and the other, what everyone's uh, speculating about though, magically completely out of nowhere, just no random things on Twitter. Just it's so weird. Right? It's like that's just like so crazy that you know everything everyone's saying about you ever. I don't get like uh I don't let it like affect my life in that way. For me, it's just loving food a lot and it just always being used as a comfort, you know? It's like my day doesn't feel full unless there's like good food in it. It's weird. Yeah, teardrop true, tropic. You miss Canada. I miss my family, but overall I'm loving the Middle East actually. I wanna get out, I wanna get healthy so I can get out and like enjoy it more. Viagra was meant to be a heart drug. Really, Olvi? I didn't know that. Calming melodies. Yeah. <laughs> Swimming in the sea? Yeah, true. I could go, but I'm afraid of it. I don't see a lot of people swimming in the sea here. <laughs> Makes me wonder, you know, why? Like, is it polluted or? I'm not sure. This is the up oh, where pretty much caught up to real time. I've been skipping forward that much. <laughs> I'm smoking today lemon mint. Okay. For some reason, she thinks that's cute, girl. That's not cute. And we're pretty much caught up to real time at this point. So, okay. yay. Thank you, sister. <laughs> I sometimes wear them, but when I'm lazy, I wear this undercap. <laughs> I've had this undercap for like, since I got first got here. I think when I got Howie, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. That's imaginary. It is the beach. Yeah, I could go to the beach every day. It's right here. You know, I don't know why I don't. This beach doesn't have, like, seats and things. The well, number one, you can always just sit down on the ground like people do at the beach. Number two, the last time that you went to the beach, it was not super fun because you nearly passed out. And you were panting a bunch. You were um, lightheaded. So I probably why... The nice beaches and parks. Oh, I might have been muted, but like, yeah, she just wants people to, I don't know, like provide seats whenever she can just sit down on the ground and stuff. I don't know. Places, they have a lot of seating. A swim is my hijab. <laughs> my favorite style of hijab is, hmm, good question. I like where like you put it like this and then I don't know how to explain it. And then you like wrap it around and then like put it in here. <laughs> Not at the moment, Cheryl. You had it. Did you lose weight? Yeah, and this is the great content that everybody, <laughs> the people uh, pay her to do for some reason. Just the wonderful, momentous, completely worth it um, content that Chantal is creating that people steal. Can you guys believe it? I can't believe people steal this. How dare they? It's always. Look at that. Anyway. And uh, I did not hear anything, but I'm going to go back just, oh, that's also another great screenshot. Just don't make me tee -hee, but um, I did not hear anything. Always, always. Did you hear that? Okay, wonderful. She's starting to hear things now. Great. Love that for us. Ugh. Yeah. 
Anyway, so I fell asleep. He ordered pizza and then I'm laying there like going through my phone and like, you know, slowly getting ready. And then I hear snoring and I'm like, what the heck? Like he barely ever snores, he must've been really tired. I pull a few. Thank you, bread and butter. The ghost. Nice, Cheryl, good for you. That's awesome. I don't know how I'm gonna like feel or look if I lose weight, but sneezy, hello. <sighs> yeah, true. Life takes us in other directions, you know. That's why I like worrying about the future too much. Like it's unpredictable. Yeah, life life takes us in so many directions that just leads you just to just happen to order pizza. Just it like it's life crazy like that. It's just so wild and so unpredictable. <laughs> When I lose weight. Yeah, Goldilocks, you did. This is a hookah, yeah. Your son could wake the house with his snoring. That's how I learned to do some of my hijabs. Like, I watch a lot of, um, I watched a lot of TikToks or Instagrams. You know? I'm free. I don't want to go for a walk like without Salah right now. <laughs> I don't know. It's... Which, why can't you just like go out to the beach and then like come right back? Like, it doesn't have to be anything super adventurous or anything, but like to the beach, even really? God, if I, if I live anywhere near a beach, I would, oh my God, I would be there every single day. Without question, just just to go out there and just like even even if it's not like the best beach, at least like it's a beach. Period. It looks pretty nice. Enjoy it. Looks almost six a.m. Thank you, Blondie Barso. I want to visit a lot of countries. I want to go to Malaysia. I want to live in Malaysia. Maybe a lot of people are moving there. Beef expensive? No, it's not. It's the same. It's like reasonable. It's calming. Melon. Why the comes along? May Allah bless you. Thank you. As you as well. We're trying to lose 40 pounds. Yeah, it's hard, eh, Blondie? Yeah, I have a couple tattoos. I have just my ears pierced. But apparently I'm not allowed to wear. Well, <laughs> um, That's a lie. She has her nose, or she did have her nose pierced. The hole is probably still there, but she had a nose ring whenever she went first went to Kuwait. It's like that show. Did you know that someone on Reddit is pretending to be you? No, I didn't know that. I don't have like a Reddit, bunch of Reddit pages, subreddit pages and stuff. It doesn't bug me at all. Gardening, yes, nice. Yeah, right. You would think. You would think like, oh, like my my babe. Even though like she definitely did not get it like legitimately, but definitely had to beg people to um subscribe to her. But like that's besides the point. Hit one hundred thousand subs. Let me be up and like make sure to make a point. And you know, if I do fall asleep, I really hope that she wakes me up to eat some pizza with her and celebrate. Nope, like she didn't even wake him up. That's the thing that like. <laughs> Just like if my partner, like, even I don't have one, but like, you know, in the hypothetical sense, had an achievement like that and we were going to celebrate, you know, even if it's just something as eat, eating a pizza, even off camera, did not wake me up, I would be not super happy. I don't know. Golden girl. I have bad sleep pattern. <laughs> Hi, Sophie. Celebrating being verified. I'm just celebrating with you guys. Oh yeah, this is a really great celebration. Aren't you guys like super uh, like happy and uplifted and just ready to party and want to like go dance out in the street like people do on um, uh, North, North American slash American uh, like uh, prescription commercials like just going out and partying. Yeah, me either. <laughs> Shisha, so hard to quit. Bye, Ghost Face. Thanks for being here. Your new name is Everyday Maryam, and your picture is just pretending to date random men on there. Hmm. All right, whatever she wants to pass it on doing. <laughs> Old me. <laughs> Thank you, so Sophie. I was going to call you Sophie because I read both space. Yes, I'm a night owl. Yep. Hard to break, you know. 
She does, even though that she got caught in a sub for sub scam going on right right around magically whenever she was starting to get a lot of subscribers out of, out of complete nowhere. Completely out of nowhere. No one knew where they were coming from. And then the second that someone um, started figuring it out, oh, there goes her subs. It's going up. And she's now at 100K. Old meat, now I can tell. Thank you, Fairy Lynn. So, yeah. I will do this, yes. I'm changing my name to Sophie Face. Yes, do it. I'm here just not chatting. That's okay, Laura. To this George's lady. Thank you. Oh, hey, Hannibal. <laughs> Who knows? Eyes. No, I'm married. Yeah, so is there a reason, like, is, honestly, is there a reason why she's still alive? Because she's honestly still just here, just talking about Julia. nothing still. Julia, Julia, I'm falling asleep, I think. Oh my god, wow, I can't imagine why. I'm also kind of falling asleep because it's not like it's a super enter entertaining live stream. I mean, it kind of was at the beginning because she was drinking juice out of the, you know, the carton slash bottle thing. But, like, we, we really haven't done much after that. Uh, I still have to wrap up the pizza. The thought of pizza is legit making me ill. Yeah, I had pizza. Oh, Michelle, thank you so much for the super chat. And also, I feel like, I mean, that's understandable. Like, honestly. But then when it comes to Chantal, like, she, girl has nothing really going for her. Can go to the beach anytime she wanted. And we, we've been maybe twice, if, if, like, if we're lucky. Twice if we're lucky. But since you were a working girl and you had things to do and life to deal with, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. But thank you for, for the super chat. I appreciate it. At the beginning. Oh my god, eats two fucks and keeps a lot. Oh no. Blood style bread? It's a pita bread. So it's not really like non. They have a lot of good pizza places, old meat. You make me wish I had a hookah. Yeah, and for some reason, instead of just going to bed, she's just going to be staying up and smoking just because some things never change. <laughs> That's the worst teardrop. It's happened to me a few times. The hook of being will sterilize the pizza. Is marriage what you expected? Yeah, well, I never... And that I never... pause and that response, I need to go back and listen to that. Is marriage everything that you expected it to be? Yeah, just like the her face, that ants. Just I need to go. I need to experience that again. That's the worst teardrop. It's happened to me a few times. The hook of will sterilize the pizza. Is marriage what you expected? Yeah, well, I never. Whenever I just, I never thought of getting married. But when I did, I thought it would be with like, oh, you know, a Western white guy, <laughs> something like that. So. Wow, that's a one hell of a response, and also, Bobella. There's a little bit of a backstory. So Chantal came live again after being live earlier and ordered ordered a pizza for her getting verified on YouTube, which means like she has over 100K and she has that little check mark next to her name. So uh, Slot orders, orders a pizza and whenever the pizza came, he fell asleep. So instead of waking him up or something, no, no, no. She ate the pizza without him and he's currently allegedly um, asleep on the bed. So... <laughs> That's the story that we know. <laughs> um, no, it's not really that different, I guess. Yeah. It's not really different than being in a relation, long-term relationship, you know? I don't know, kind of. It feels more... I don't know. For someone that... Like, honestly, Chantal has has gone, gone on and stated, like, this is, like, her soulmate. If my soulmate gave, like, an answer like that, I would be giving so many questions to, to that person because... Uh, that is not the, like, honestly, that's not the answer I was expecting from her at all. The fa? Wow, that's really telling, honestly, if I've ever heard any sort of answer about <laughs> that. More permanent, more like, it's like a family, like, you know, who to beauty? No, but I support her 100%. I will be, I will get some next time if I make it. It's probably as cold as the fridge in your apartment. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh, between the toes is the worst. 
Sorry for blowing it in your face. <laughs> no, smoking is probably not. Okay. And she's not sorry because she keeps doing it, even though people, even like her own supporters say, stop it. She still does it. Why? Because she's a dick. That plain and simple will never change. Anything that's convenient for anybody else? Nope, got to do it two times just to make sure that that the um that the audience gets a taste of it. So so annoying. Okay, love. Neither with pizza. I wanted to do Twitch tonight, but I guess tomorrow. Anyway. Yeah, she has good makeup, babe. Fatima. Sorry, I keep like not saying your name right. I need to plan a visit in Canada. I don't have any plans right now, Kathleen. Dog puke is like so much bigger. <laughs> there you go, Jay. My eyesight is any glasses. Yeah. Nope, even though she was screaming and crying about um, somebody else smoking around their pets, yet um, does the same exact thing. So, not super surprised. Chantal. Yeah, people. some people call me Chantal. Chantel. Chantal, that's how you say it. French people can always say it, because they have the accent. You know? So, okay, I need to go back and listen. Like, what's the official name, how to say her name? Because I'm pretty sure that she screws it up <laughs> at the beginning. Because people call her Chantel, which um, her name is Chantal, I believe. But let's, let's go. I just want to go back to make sure I hear this right. There you go, Jay. My eyesight is, I need glasses. Chantal. Yeah, people, some people call me Chantal. Chantel. Chantal, that's how you say it. French Ch people. Chantal? Or... Hold on. French people can always say it because they have the accent. Chantal. That's how you say it. Chan Chan Chantal. Chantal? Is that. I Has anyone ever heard her say her name like that? Chan Chantal? And also Alexis Sam. I just. Especially, he, she did not even wake him up for the pizza party. Like that's pretty much sacred to Chantal. Like ordering pizza and then like not waking him up is just like that's a really big tell. If I'm being quite honest with you, Chantal. I've never. I've always thought that her name was Chantal. Uh, that's news to me, I guess. Chant Chantal. French people can always say it because they have the accent, you know. Good night, coffee is, there, is your love language. Kitty love. Oh, her sister Mona, yeah. Just Good gonna. Night, babes. Mom. <laughs> oh, Lord. Go, go, quit. Oh, my God. So. Girl, at what point do you just go, okay, I'm going to be getting off. Like, the only thing that she's been doing is eating, talking about food, wiping her eyes, and smoking. That's pretty much this entire live stream, if you guys haven't not, <laughs> if you guys weren't here earlier. There you go. You're all cut up. You're welcome. We picked the name together, because when I took my show, they were like, ask your husband what name he would like you to take. It was so, like, culturally different for me, because I'm like, oh, I don't get to choose. She's like, no, choose with him. I'm like, okay. Non is so good, Megan. Yes, I'm glad you're here. Your husband calls you bum. Any pet name is cute. Spliffy. <laughs> yeah, he's a very jealous person. <laughs> but most Arab men are extremely jealous. It's like a culture thing for them. They call it um, protective jealousy. So... My cat just insulted me. He's oh my. Me. And her mind right there? Because she, she gave a little sassy look. Hold on. Right here, she's saying, where's your man? Where's your man to, to feel jealous over you? Where's your, well, Chantal, <laughs> where's your man? Um, well, he's currently asleep because you didn't wake him up for the pizza party, so. Go wake up your man for the pizza party, even though that was like um, an hour and a half ago, huh? My cat just insulted me. He started cleansing himself. <laughs> they hate that, eh? They get all mad. My favorite part about myself? Hmm. I guess my ability to to learn and you know. Yeah. 
<laughs> and what's even funny, you're such a serious about that, yes, sir. <laughs> that's <laughs> funny it's really funny <laughs> oh good girl keep on keep telling these jokes they're great <laughs> i believe to learn from things and be appreciative in life <laughs> <laughs> Bravo. That's great. And tell us more. Tell us more. It's, it's wonderful. <laughs> uh. Yeah, yeah I, I, I don't know. It's like different. It's not like, um, you know, it's hard to explain if you're not in the culture and you haven't lived it. Do you know what I mean? But Oh, it says the woman that's never, that's, well, sorry, hardly ever left her, her home. And experienced the culture that she super glued herself onto. She's really going to be <laughs> gonna be teaching us Westerners about like the culture over there, ma'am. Because like in the culture, they see like a man if he's not doesn't have protected jealousy over his woman. Oh, don't worry, Alexis. He's seen as a day youth, like somebody who just like doesn't care if other men look at their woman or hit on their woman or don't care what their women wear if they show their body, all that and this and that, you know. <laughs> that's, that's true. That's what I've you know, learned. The resilience here. Mm -hmm. Our personality. Thank you, Laura. That's nice of you. Um, I guess what I've heard him compliment me about is, you know, it says I take good care of him. Um, you know, if he has a headache in the night or something like that, I'll just, even if I'm sleeping, I'll get up and get him some pills and water and I don't know just like stuff like that but most people do that um even if I don't like to cook for myself I'll cook for him something he thinks I'm very beautiful uh, I make him laugh my first love was Arabic I thought we were going to get married Karima yes he was very very jealous Kathleen yeah anyone who's ever dated an Arab man you can't say they weren't jealous it's not well not everybody but it's like um was it Nader also then wouldn't you say that he, he was being protective over Didi because he chose Didi too? Like, um, anyways, if you don't want to go yeah. there. Um, how they are, you know? If you're green, what do you mean? <laughs> Jay. Hi, hi, Webe. Matok, what does that mean, Fatima? Yeah, he says he's never met someone like me, like, who brings out, like, a silly side in him, you know. Oh, girl, I think there's a lot of people in life that's never met anyone like you, and that's probably not a bad thing. I hate saying that, but like at the same time, do you blame me? I have him saying all my sayings and stuff. Good night, Lois. If a man is not jealous, means he doesn't love you. They don't understand open minded thinking. Yeah, because the fasting, um, I think it starts the 10th, the evening of the 10th, Anastasia. Thank you, Teardrop. He's like, and so he is very handsome, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Can't say he's not. Well, I mean, honestly, they, does she have any other sort of compliments to give him other than just being handsome in her in her eyes? Like, you know, he's really smart, really witty, really funny, really helpful, really, you know, good with electronic. Like, anything else other than handsome? Because that's the only thing that I've ever heard about him. Don't enter it. Yes, even in our elevator, like, sometimes there's, like, a man. They just know, you know? <laughs> so I I love learning about Kuwait and the culture. Yeah. Well, I mean, if you ever want to teach us anything other than like the, you know, the things that we haven't been, to, you know, been over 20 times, that would be great. That would be great. I would love that. But we won't get it because effort on her end. I think great believe recommendations. Make sure they're homemade again. Try, don't try the ones in the can the first time. But they're easy to make, so I'm going to be making them. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> No, Shelly, I don't think so. His sister, no. There's a lot done to protect and cherish the women with all the Islamophobia. A lot of people think the opposite. Yeah, they see it as controlling and, you know, but culturally in Islam and in the culture, they're raised to protect the women. Like, you know, um, yeah. But I can see why, because like the man is meant to be like obeyed and stuff like that. But he has to also take care of the woman in a lot of ways. 
Hi, Angela. Too many rules. <laughs> the East and the West are very different. Yeah. Okay. Are we done? Can, can we not? <laughs> More family involvement. Yeah. Hello, Elliot. They act like men don't have rules. Oh, they do. They're supposed to. <laughs> Some of them forget it. Shelly, I don't I want to talk about that, but a lot of those things in the culture are very repressed. Very. Okay, Carrie Lynn, have a good night. I did was trying to do hard. So yeah, it's very different, but I'm able to adopt and I understand the reasoning behind it. And honestly, I like to feel like Oh no worries, Sarah. Have a wonderful night. You know, protected in a lot of ways. I don't know. Again, says uh, I honestly don't think that he could like open up a pickle jar, if I'm being quite honest with you. <laughs> he can't walk alone on the street. No, it's not like that now, Belly. Women are like free to do whatever. It's more of a thing between them and their husbands. Like it depends on the culture. You know, like it's a lot of Syrian. So Syrian culture, a bit different than Kuwaiti culture, but very similar in a lot of ways too. We want to laugh, Alana. <laughs> yeah, baby Jane, he is. Life is too short not to be happy, yeah. Really, Angela? You wouldn't go in the elevator if it was just a man? Yeah, see, there's some reasoning behind it, you know? Um, for sure, yeah. I think people, like, just misunderstand the culture a lot, you know? It feels good to have a husband that you feel safe with, with and protected, yeah. For sure. But that's what I'm saying. So, she's... Okay, this is her live right now. So... We're just talking in circles at this point. There's nothing new, nothing exciting to talk about. We're just talking about Saul at this point, which, I mean, okay, great. We are we don't want him back. We're good. Thanks. Can we talk about something else or just leave <laughs> at this point? He understands where I come from, you know? So where I come from, it was like, you know, men and women are 50-50 when it comes to they do the same tasks. Here, they're 50-50, but different ways different roles so like he would never let me carry anything in the house like he would be embarrassed if like someone in public saw me carrying any groceries when I'm with him you know like or things like this Like he like most. Of the I've never wanted in my life to open up a window and then and throw a shisha machine out the window. I've never been so tempted in my life. <laughs> Just I hate that thing so much. I hate it. Time anyway, unless I beat him to it. But he he would be like feel embarrassed if he doesn't open the door for me. You know, like um, if I open the door for him, that's a no no. Like I can't open the door for him. <laughs> like little things like this. You know. So there's like some chivalry, there's some like cultural values that he still has, but. He's your job. Yeah, and there's a lot of things that's, you know, why I'm here after everything, because I evaluate all of the pros versus, you know, one incident, you know. Oh, and one incident, you know, just um, your man talking to another lady and uh, sending photos. Obviously, there was that one censored photo that, you know, definitely was not 100% shown, even though that there was proof of that. And all oh, the text messages, just one thing. That's fine. I mean, like, it's her prerogative if she wants to stay, but uh, things have not been the same since she's, since she's gotten back. And that's very obvious. And why she hasn't seen that yet, I have no idea. But, you know, it's her life. No one can tell her anything. Nothing to. Oh, and sorry about that. If, it doesn't, if anything ever happens, I can just be on my way. But, 
you know, marriage is Which also, what happily married couple even, like, why is that even a thought in their mind? If there wasn't already issues? Girlie, go home. Worth working on. Your husband does all the outside work and repairs, but also helps me with the house. Yeah. Yeah, he will too. If he sees I'm tired, especially with, like, he likes to vacuum, like, to help me if, if he needs to. <sighs> yeah, Living Laura, true. I already kind of feel like I don't want to go out myself because I'm so used to, you know, <laughs> broke. Also, on top of that, why is she why is she staying alive so often? Like the last time that she did this, she was mad and she was not super happy. Uh, she usually on I, I hate even kind of admitting this, but she usually just goes live for like an hour, hour and a half usually. But she already did that, and then on top of that, went live for another hour and forty minutes. Girl, what's wrong? What's wrong? Just go home. Just I just either you know at least go to sleep. Jesus. Sandra, thank you. You know, when I go out, it's just me. I have to worry about everything. When I go out with him, I feel like I don't even have to use my brain. Like, he just does everything. He takes care of everything. You know, buys everything. Communicates with everyone. Like, opens my door. I don't even have to do anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for sure, really. Sometimes I do. Husbands have been forgiven for a lot worse things. Yeah. Being vegetarian? You mean? I know. It, it is annoying. I know. Sorry, guys almost finished <laughs> okay so acknowledges like the chat hey that's knowing oh it's almost done T he girl stop it we don't want it anymore she, I, I swear that it's like the chat is speaking directly to her hey we don't like this hmm. oh well hmm. doesn't bother me like one of the most selfish people I think I've ever witnessed <laughs> Yeah, some would say it doesn't help me, but where my blood clots came from. How are you? How did I know about them? Because I was getting like a lot of shortness of breath and chest pain. Like abnormally shortness of breath. And look at all the passenger princess wives who take the husband's shopping for bras. <laughs> me, BS. Remember when I went to buy a shopping with Salah? <laughs> so cute. Yeah, like I kind of like being a passenger princess. I gotta admit, I like being pampered a little bit, you know? <laughs> oh yeah pampered from all the work and every single thing that you have to do on a day-to-day -day basis yeah you deserve to be pampered with all the hardships and all the everything that you have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis which is just um whenever i find a really good counterpoint to that i'll let you guys know but like yeah there's just so much to be pampered for just so many of them whenever i find again like i said if i ever find a reason i'll let you guys know <laughs> Okay, Angela. Hi, Curly Pops. You like walking around your neighborhood alone? <laughs> Charles Reed. It's late. It's early. It's like six. The air in Bali. Austrian beer. Really? It sounds like a much better life than we had in Canada. It's very different. Yeah, I feel more spiritual for sure. I'm not a perfect Muslim. I hope to, to improve that, inshallah. During Ramadan, I still struggle a lot, but a lot of people who are religious struggle, you know? So, yeah, but I don't know. Look at Julia. Yeah, no one's perfect. Yeah, no one's perfect. Perfect Muslim is impossible. Boy, Boulevard. I'm muted. Sorry about that. Um, her name is Boulevard now, which I'm also looking at her on another screen right now. So that just a bit, like kind of check in if she's currently like not live or live and she's still live. She's just showing Julia love her, but just like, no, we're good. So Julia. <laughs> Well, she calls Julia. It went from Julia to Gulia to Bulia to, I guess, now Boulevard. So that's the evolution of the nickname. <laughs> Why? I could not tell you. Uh, okay. So, Julia. Actually, got. Okay. 
I need to run AFK really. I need to pee so badly. I, I was going to go after I got done with the first live, but like I haven't gone yet. I need to use the bathroom while she's showing off Julia, which again, adorable, but I will be right back. I've held it. I've held it as long as I can. And um, it's catching up with me. I'll be right back. Okay, I am so sorry about that, but it was getting rough. <laughs> Let me show you her. Oh my gosh, you guys. Got it. Okay, bye, girly pops. She's just almost finished. I feel like the caterpillar from Alice in Wonderland. And she stayed up for so late that that's another screenshot I'm going to take for later. But she has been up for so long that um, the sun's coming up behind her. So. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, Russian Persian, but mixed. That's why she has spots. No way, you think so? She's funny. La. The stuff of La Dim. <laughs> on top of that, like, why she's forcing herself to stay on live, even though she, you, you can tell that she doesn't want to be here. I like, why is she being on here? I have no idea. Words like a stafala, but you hear that a lot. You hear, you know, shukran, stuff like that all the time here. The window's open? No, because I don't have screens and I'm paranoid she'll jump out. So I don't know. Also, on top of that, I'm not exactly sure if it's the way that her face is angled, but like this eye and this, these are, both of these eyes are definitely not looking super even, and that's kind of scary. A lot. I hear you as a crying shame. It enlarges the stomach with air. You will feel more hungry. Really? Ah, interesting belly. We used to have a hook of lounge where I have, but they got tired of all the kids coming. Oh, really? Ah, interesting teardrop. So. On top of that, Chantal, I really honestly never want to ever hear you talk about anyone's side profile ever again. And on top of that, I do see a few hairs sticking out, so. I don't usually have more than one a day. Yesterday, I didn't have any. Thanks, 
Solana. Bismillah. Bismillah Akamani Akakim. This is the great content that people are just stealing from her and just profiting off of. Oh my, just the, the sheer audacity of people stealing this content. How dare they? How absolutely dare they steal this absolutely magnificent, one-of-a-kind, completely unique content? God help me. <laughs> yep, this is Chantal's content now, just sucking and complaining. There you go. That's the whole live stream. You're welcome. Small. I thought Cormo was small. It's 46,000. When I lived in PEI, I lived in a town that had 80 people. 80. <laughs> it was small as heck, boring. But it was like bucolic, you know, it was like a lot of green. It was really nice. Thank you, Golden. I want to go to the beach. It's nice out. I can tell. Look at the sun. Boulevard. I want to go walking up. Oh, boulevard. Oh, my gosh. Please. Stop. We get like a tub of it. The tobacco, it's like wet. It has flavor and honey. Oh, my gosh. Let me guess. It's so much better than actual normal smoking because there's not as many vapors. And it's just, like, all vapor, so it's not that bad for you guys. Like, don't worry about it, God. It's a bit sweet. Thank you, Lynn. It's coming off, but I got to go wash my And face. also, right. <laughs> I'm in Howie's room. So whenever I get my plaque, I'm going to set up Howie's room. Oh, Yogi. <laughs> Thank you so much for the super chat. Yeah, how dare I? Just... Make money off of this complete artwork of a of a video. How dare I? Just so rude. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. Uh. Cheap decorations from Timu, <laughs> and just like or could like decorate it nice, medicinal. Heck yeah, I'm going to show my plaque off. Tobacco-free shisha? You're not eligible for a plaque. Your channel was terminated. You're not supposed to have a channel that's terminated to get a plaque. So essentially, you went through all that trouble for nothing. Great job. <laughs> I'm not oh, sure. Oh, Kelly, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Chocolate. I smoke so much cigarettes. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well... Yeah, I don't like the smell of them. I should take you guys to the district where we buy. Um, there's like a district with so many shisha shops. I wonder if Salah would want to go and film and film. And also on top of that, this is supposed to be, you know, this is supposed to be the last shisha. So like, why are we going to be buying more shisha things if we're quitting after this one? Hmm. I have a feeling that it's not going to be the last one, unfortunately, but... And they're in, like... I don't know. He has friends everywhere. Like, if I need something for my phone... Oh, my friend has a shop. I'm going to go get you a new phone case. Uh, if I need a new vape... Oh, my friend has a vape shop. I'm going to go get you a vape. Mm -hmm, sure, these magical friends that none of us have ever seen nor heard about, but magically... Mm -hmm, sure. Uh, Michelle, thank you so much for the super chat, and probably I wouldn't be super surprised. Like you know, her man's asleep. He missed the pizza party. How dare he fall asleep? Even though Chantal had every opportunity to wake him up for the pizza. Nope, not way too much to ask. So she's turning to her chat for comfort and support, which you can find that all back in Canada if you go back, which I highly suggest. But you know, neither here or there. <laughs> Oh, like when we had the old car. Oh, my car needs brakes. My friend has a shop. I'm okay, gonna... well, which car? Because you've you've had multiple. <laughs> magically, you know, he was doing not super awful, but like he wasn't as well off now. But now magically after meeting you, oh, yeah, no, he can afford so many brand new things and a new laptop and gaming setup and this and that and the other new 
apartments, new cars. Yeah, it's magical. It's completely out of the blue. I'm going to get the red district. Put nicotine so when you crave, it comes up there. Good idea, Valley. And you see them make it. The shisha, no. I could just, you just buy it already made. But the, the shots have all kinds of cool hookah machines and stuff like that. Salon the Mafia. No, it's just like that here. Like everybody know, like has like, you know, friends for everything. He has so many friends. Yeah. Notice how she keeps saying he has so many friends. Not like we have so many friends or, you know, his friends. No, just he has friends, which that's kind of sad. But like you can't make friends if you don't at least attempt to, girly. Come on. Sorry, creature comfort. He has connections everywhere. Yeah, it comes in handy though. Okay, Alana, thanks for coming. Your mom was like this to everyone. <laughs> when home phones was a thing, mine got shut off. She called and talked to a woman she knew. And it got turned back on instantly. <laughs> yeah, teardrop, true way. Eh? It's good to know people sometimes. Yeah, he's sleeping. I don't want to like wake him, but yeah, I could take you guys shopping and show you. I don't know if I'll sleep, so maybe when he wakes up, but. Did, okay, so did she just say that she's not going to sleep? So she hasn't been to sleep at all since her last live before this, right? Hold on. Yeah, I could take you guys shopping and show you. I don't know if I'll sleep, so maybe when he wakes up. No, so that kind of just confirms that she she has not been asleep at all this entire time. She's she spent the past eh, two hours just being awake, eh, unless if she might have slept before then. But I don't know. So interesting. But Salah was born here. I think he was born in Kuwait. I think. I mean, for someone that claims that this is their soulmate, you would think you would know after a year, like, where your partner's born, at least. Like, a bare minimum starting talking points in my mind. Like, uh, I would sure think that she would know where her man was born and, like, the things and, like, when his birthday is and how old he is, even though that contention's been kind of weird because he's been, like, two or three ages. <laughs> so. Okay. Mm-hmm. She's been alive that long. Yes. So, yeah. There's a lot more to explore here anyways. But just have to be, like, well enough. Have the energy. Okay, well, I'm not really seeing... I'm just going to skip forward again because I'm not really seeing you making any sort of improvements to try to do that, girly. Did I miss all your emojis? Stop! I, again, never in my life have I, have I been so tempted to take a shisha machine just throw that thing out the window. Okay, what does that mean? Oh, you didn't even budge. Yeah, great. Yep, great job. A plus. Anyways. The devil's uh, doing mirror dressers across from the bed, meaning you can see everything. <laughs> yes. Oh, Ruby, hey, girl. Um, so kind of a rundown if you guys did not make the beginning of this stream, even though I kind of covered two streams because like right as I was finishing the first one, she decided to come live again for some reason. So um, she wanted to to celebrate. Um, I can actually kind of show you actually if I just remove this. Hold on. And can I just do this? OK, I can. So um, essentially what happened is pizza party. 
um, she's eating pizza. She keeps wiping her eyes because they keep watering. And then on top of that, she had one other slice of pizza. And then at some point, she starts drinking juice out of the actual carton itself and not necessarily, there we go, not necessarily getting a glass. She just kind of raw dogs it and just drinks it right there. And then since then, we've just been talking about nothing, about Everything, her man, nothing, the culture, Ramadan, kind of the, you know, very basic thing. She got this weird tent thing for Julia. There was a random soccer ball here also in the living room, which was not explained at all as to why there was a soccer ball there. I probably shouldn't have just did that, but like, you know, whatever. But <laughs> random soccer ball, smoking, smoking, um, smoking eye wipes, just nothing, nothing necessarily. <laughs> like, look. Yeah, but wait, thank you, thank you. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much the rundown of um the this last latest live stream. Oh, yep, yeah, at one hundred percent, not even over exaggerating, she was drinking juice out of the. If I can actually, oh, there, there it was. Hold on. No, I move or move. I oh, yep, yeah, yep. Just drinking it out of the out of the thing itself. <laughs> oh, Smurfette! I'm, I'm very glad that <laughs> very glad that that very uh, brief rundown was enough. Because honestly, I think that was even way too much um, of an explanation about what happened. But like, yeah, that's that's pretty much what happened. Oh, and also that she did her blood read, I uh, blood sugar reading, and it was thirteen point five, I believe thirteen point five. When, um, when five is supposed to be like within normal range or what it should be at, or like that, you know, roughly around five. So, double and a half about what's supposed to be. Oh, there's Julia. Okay. What? At this point, why doesn't she just <laughs> go to bed? Could not tell you. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Wait, hold on, hold on. Yep. Yeah. It's supposed to be for the guests and for Ramadan, even though it's not. Okay, great. Hey. Oh. How big you are. Oh, she's so precious, but like at the same time, no. We're good. <laughs> Love her to death. She's absolutely precious, but just I, I will save you guys from the <laughs> I will save you. We can look at. I don't know if you guys ever wanted to know how I did, how I do my th my thumbnails or how I get them how I do. I just do this because you can get some really interesting <laughs> pictures like this. This is exactly how I do it. I wish I was over exaggerating. Say it's just absolutely perfect. I'm also watching her on on another screen so that way we can kind of. Not okay, she's back. It's not a litter bug. There we go. You're welcome. <laughs> I could not marry a smoker. You guys want to see the, the beach? Hold on. We're girl <laughs> angles thing. Oh, <sighs> oh, hi, girl. We quit like let her wrestle. So I need to add me, add me back. Hi, I'm here. <laughs> oh, girl. I know that she, of all people, is not calling Julia a seal. Ma'am. Ma'am. Stop it. <laughs> Whoa, the sun is bright. Ew. I will say that that is gorgeous. It kind of sucks that there's a road right there, but like, regardless, that's beautiful. Ugh. There's the beach. 
Oh my gosh, there's the beach that we never go to for some reason, even though it's right across the street and it's absolutely gorgeous and that would be great content to show us. But like actually going out there, absolutely not. That would require effort and motivation and time. And also I just don't want to do it. So I, here it is from 20 feet away. Just like, let me zoom in real quick. Yep, there we go. There's the beach, guys. You're welcome for that amazing content that people steal from. How dare they? Morning, cool. It's nice out. I want to go for a walk later. Thank you. So nice, eh? What's illegal, RGB? Okay, this was this was cute, but she's back and she's also really close and also sitting Can't down. Stand everywhere. Like that. <laughs> There's palm trees. What do they see? If you want to see negative, you'll see negative. If you want to see positive, you're going to see positive. Well, that? I mean, with a blood sugar rating of 13.5 and eating pizza and also eating like a foot long, I'm not really seeing a bunch of the positive stuff here. Is anybody else? <laughs> a sandcastle, yeah. I know the sun is hot. <sighs> the sand gets in every crack. Beezing in the ocean. I don't have appropriate swim attire. I don't know. I'm going to swim in my pool, maybe, inshallah. We'll see. <laughs> no, me. Hey, Dodo. My call phone. Oh, look, I'm not sad. I'm happy. Oh, yeah, you seem absolutely thrilled. You know, I'm so sorry for confusing the complete bleakness of um, happiness. Forgive me. My hands have always been chubby and bloated. <sighs> Anyway. By that, I think she means fat. Anyway. As somebody that has kind of, you know, fat hands myself, I can I can say that the fat. Um. Anyways, guys. Oh, there it is. Anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna get off of here, so it's gonna be ending here pretty soon, within you know ten minutes or so, because the Chantal loves to do that. I think I'm gonna be getting off of here just real, real quick, guys. Here pretty soon, and then spends another you know five, ten, fifteen, twenty minutes saying goodbye for some reason. So I think that she's about to get off of here pretty soon. My room is dark too. Yeah, our room is dark. Canada Canadian. Go for a nice morning walk. What are you doing? Okay, guys. Thanks for coming here. And, um, beezing. Yeah, I need water now. And, uh, I will see you. Guys. And before the, she uh, ends the live, she's ending off with 344 viewers. 347. And I believe that she's leaving. Please. Thank you, Dodo. Oh, my screen went black. What happened? There we go. I'll see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye, Becca. Okay, and she... Okay, well, I'm just going to take a screenshot of that and then and there because she ended the live stream. So, 300 and... How, 347 is what she ended off with, and we... I never thought that we would be fucking done with it, but we made it! Congratulations! <laughs> Woo! Oh, Lord, I need to take this out of my ear for a bit because... Ooh. <sighs> All right. Well, I'm so sorry that that lasted so much longer than expected. I was expecting one live stream and it ended up being two. So sorry about that. But it's never a dull moment in this community, let me tell you. And I have been live for almost, well, actually over three hours. Was not expecting that in the slightest. But there we go. <laughs> actually, just in case if anyone wanted to get a screenshot of this, you're welcome. <laughs> Well, with that being said, loves, I, I am definitely going to go because I need to shower and eat and do 
human stuff, unfortunately. But <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys, I guess, whenever she uploads next. And hopefully not again today. But, well, you know, after I sleep. How's that? Okay, bye! <laughs>